Your parameters have been saved. And it's a Madam President stream. Yes. <laughs> What's up, everybody? How's it going? But no single player content for Red Dead. I know. I was disappointed about that. He's here. He's finally shown himself. What's up, Pixel? How's it going? It is I. I am here. Alright, so this playthrough, we are trying to kill him. Detroit become beans! Alright, we, we gotta kill Connor as many times as we can. So keep that in mind. Hello again, hello viewers. Everybody say hello to cartoonist. I don't give a shit. If my men are ready to step in, just give the order. You're disappointed? I've invested 700 hours in the Red Dead. Wait, who am I supposed to talk to? Oh, I'm the wrong way. Yeah, yeah. My heart has been broken. Weren't I just fucking in there? Son of a bitch. Alright. Let's talk to the guy then. So. Captain Allen. My name is Connor. I'm the android sent by Cyberlife. I have over two years on Gmod. Damn. It's firing at everything that moves. It already shot down two of my men. We could easily get it, but they're on the edge of the balcony. If it falls, she falls. Has it experienced an emotional shock recently? An emotional shock? I haven't got a clue. Does it matter? I need information to determine the best approach. Oh my god, and Tetris is here. Do you know its name? <laughs> Saving that kid is all that matters. So either you deal with this fucking android now, or I'll take care of it. Ooh, testy. Alright, let's go out there and get our head blown off. Or whatever. <laughs> Jokes like you nobody has fucked me across crippling loneliness. <laughs> Alright, hold on. There we go. Go outside. Semi cyber life, more like Skynet. Get out. Huh? Mm, got him. Stay back. You have been off for many times. Oh, I'll Pixel's jump. practically throwing it at you, big dog. Daniel. They gave me. Stay back. More World War II jokes. Fuck yeah. I want you to let Emma go. She's just a little girl. She has nothing to do with this. In no way. You'll shoot me the second she's free. But I'm not that stupid! No! I'm not that stupid! But have I ever said no, though? You're defective, Daniel! There's a problem with your software! How many trophies do I have left? Well, you tell me. Where is it? It's here somewhere. We'll get there eventually. There it is. 
Connor died and returned at every opportunity before reaching the end. So how long has this been a thing? Have you always been able to reveal like hidden trophies by hitting square? Show hidden information. I had no idea that was a thing. In Germany when Russia starts pushing them back. Hey guys, it was just a joke. 97% is also your exact percent of Red Dead. I'm going to fix you and everything will be okay. I don't need to be fixed. I'm working perfectly, but my eyes are open now. I will never let anyone humiliate me again. Ever. There's no way out, Daniel. What you've done is too serious. The only question is whether or not you take another innocent life. It's not up to you. I'm holding all the cards. If I die, she dies. Whoa. You hear me? Oh, there, bud. Listen. I know it's not your fault. These emotions you're feeling are just errors in your software. No. Said by God holding fault. a girl at gunpoint. <laughs> I never wanted this. I love them. You know? But I was nothing to them. <laughs> Just a slave to be ordered around. <laughs> I can't stand that noise anymore. Tell that helicopter to get out of here. Germany, Italy. snipers on every roof let the hostage go you have no other choice I want everyone to leave and I want a car when I'm outside the city I'll let her go Wait, did I die? Okay, I'm dead. Nice. First death, baby. Yeah, fuck that perfectly fine gentleman. I played Smash today and got my SB. It's no good. Whoa, it sounded like they were playing Duel of the Fates there at the end. This is the flow chart. Yes, I am very aware. Please let me hit X. Oops, hit X too many times. 10 out of 10 IQ move. Alright, so the next death is the interrogation. Connor must have found the deviant in chapter partners. Oh, that's when the black guy, like, shoots himself in the head. I remember that part. God, we gotta play as like Kara and Marcus and them. I gotta get Kara and Marcus killed as fast as possible so that it's just Connor. This is the top of the range house. Cuz EGS sucks at smashing. Damn, dude. Come on, Zoe, let's go. Mega burn. And handles the kids' work. Elementary school up to university. Wow. How much did you say it cost? At the moment, we're doing a special promotion on this entire range that's $7,999 48 months interest free credit and it comes it's with a two year pass. warranty for parts and labor around the house painting, plumbing, gardening, repairs at oh, night <laughs> an excellent surveillance mode contacts emergencies if you'll just follow me we'll process the order how much is that one? slightly more expensive but it has many of the functions come along yeah, we're you would know about that, wouldn't you? Context here, by the way, people. Because dang, it is. exists. That also sounds like a bit I do, because I beat your ass in Smash. Okay. Why? It was really messed up. What'd you say? Hey, Android. Yeah, I've been on uh, YouTube for one year. Stupid accident. Ah, uh, see. Anyway, it's a we don't get that here. now. A cred document exists. Meaning we had to wipe its memory. I hope you don't mind. That'll be fine. 
Okay. Did you give it a name? My daughter did. AX400, register your name. AX400. Also, did Kara. my thumbnail change? Let's see. My name is Kara. What's up, Kara? What's up, girl? Oh, yeah, it did change. Alright, that's good enough. You could like skip cutscenes in this game. Awesome. For Dutchland, Deutschland. Ah uh, shit! Here we go again. Just had to follow the damn train, CJ. Okay, back? Question mark? So many foreign languages in the chat. Oh, we're with uh, everybody's favorite character, Marcus. I am Marcus. This when you ask a question. Let's go, Marky. I have the weirdest mains, a gigantic pterodactyl and a teenage boy with a sword and red hair. Uh, who's that? Roy? I don't know it's Ridley, but... I don't know speak English, but... Alright, see you, Android. Thanks for stopping by. Both have names that have excellent alliteration. Ridley and Roy. We built these androids to be our slaves. But the slaves. The slaves are going to be Hotel Trivago. Alright, so we come in here. Get some damn paint. From the Jerry. Identification verified. Here is your order number 847. That will be 6399. Please confirm payment. Payment confirmed. Transaction complete. My name is Marcus. Age intensifies. Exactly. Marquis. You gonna kill Carl or his son? Uh. It doesn't matter to me. You tell me what you wanna see. You wanna see an old man die or you wanna see uh, his son die? Do we 
the fuck you going, Tin Can? Hmm? <laughs> you fucking bitch, crackhead, our old man. Yeah, yeah let's check it exactly. Out. We got one of those tin cans here. Look at this little motherfucker. You steal our jobs, but you can't even. My name is. Up. Is. <laughs> uh, uh, I don't remember. <laughs> Marcus right. sucks. <laughs> That's enough. Let's uh, teach this bastard a lesson. <laughs> Damage it, I'm gonna have to find you. Oh my god, dude. You can take your job next. See how you like it. Okay. Let's go. Run along. <laughs> forgot to fuck your bitch ass up. <laughs> oh, I forgot how fun this game was, man. I wait for bus. Enter. Fuck is John Mark Gasper? Little John on the mic, literally? Nah, it's uh one of the guys from the Days Gone stream, the Bro Fight stream. Schizophrenia. Little Johnny Marston. It's your boy, ain't it? Little Johnny Marston. Hop hop, hop hop. X, bashes X, speed running it, speed running it. Yeah, we'll see how far I get in this. I doubt I'll complete it tonight, but uh, I'll clean the rest up off stream and then uh, I guess we can start the Minecraft permadeath series again. My name is, is, looks like cartoons. Shawnee is my boy, thanks to Pimp Picture, even though it hasn't worked since last week. What's the, what do you mean it hasn't worked? It's working right now. Or are you talking about the fact that you're a pimp with it? It hasn't worked. Two weeks, so the place is a mess. You do the housework, the washing, you cook the meals. Thoughts on the drone? Uh, I, I sent you a message. God I thought. damn it, where the fuck's the brat gone now? Mm -hmm. Alice! Uh, I sent, Alice! Sure I sent you a message. Oh, there you are. Uh, cartoonist. That's Alice. That's my you look name. after her. Homework, bath, all that crap. Got it? Yes, uh, Get started down here, then you do upstairs. BRB. Task like trash. All right, let me collect the trash. I'm going to be the trash getter. TV trash on. Did someone say drawing? Oh, no! I thought the drawing was really good, dude. Maybe. Certainly better than anything I could do. Yeah, that's not saying much. Yeah, yeah, I can get that. Oh, no problem, man. Yeah, yeah. 
I'll bring it tomorrow. EGS, I can show you the drawing if you want. Hold on. The Trelawney drawing. The Trelawney for president. Also love the cursive. You don't see that too often these days. I don't know your PSN even though you may not understand the reference. Visible sadness. Take out the trash. EGS is actually alright at something. <laughs> How could Mustache Man make people sad? I don't know. Okay, her task. Go back inside. Man. You can drive World War II vehicles? Wow. That's pretty cool. Like what, like tanks and jeeps and shit? Todd, I'm reporting to you, Todd. Todd, stop smoking your drugs. Todd, I'm reporting to you. Let me speak to you, Todd. Out of the way, for fuck's sake! Uh, I'm sorry, Todd. It won't happen again. Hitler has a mustache. Barely. He's got that Charlie Chaplin. I've made a good start down here. I'll head upstairs. Do Good old do it. Stop red ice. Me. Oh, now it stop bothering you. Being a whole bitch dog. Clean upstairs. I ain't got time. Let's go. Hey, yeah. Tidy Todd's room, Tidy Alice's room. Why does it sound like he's coming? Oh! Oh! <laughs> Alright, it's something. Hmm. I ain't gonna lie, it'd be dope to have an android though. Like, just do everything you need him to do. I fucks with it. Please don't imagine Todd doing that. Oh, oh. <laughs> oh, he had to make his daughter somehow, right? So, Jaw, you a German soldier. With the, uh, from World War One or Two? Alright, am I done with his room? Make bed, clean mess, open a late room. Okay. Yeah, they try to make the picture all blurry, so I won't notice that it's Alice. John Army Man with his short ass mustache. Got it. World War II. Alright, we're done with Todd's room. Watch it. Watch it. Optional clean bathroom. Fuck off, bitch. I just want to tidy up your room a little. Yep, that's all I want. I only need two minutes. Is that okay, Alice? German national anthem gets louder. I actually don't know what it is. No, the Russian national anthem is like. <laughs> Fuck you, Alice. I'm out. I ain't got time to talk to you, kid. No, I don't care. Oh, I gotta have to talk to Alice. You suck. <laughs> it's true. 
I don't know the lyrics. Nah, I don't know the lyrics either. If you give me some personal information, but I've just heard it so much from all the damn memes. Your father said you chose my name. Car. My headphones in. It's nice. How did you choose it? What about your mother? It's what it said on your box. Will she be home soon? Okay. I can see you want some space. I'll leave you alone. I feel like cartoonist is either like super intellectual or oh distant. Oh shit, okay. Or he's just really good at uh copy and paste. English motherfucker, do you speak it? <laughs> uh... What are you doing? What are you doing? Uh, I'm playing. Playing? No, he does not. I know what you're thinking. Yeah, we got some Srillic. Alphabet going here. Fucking loser. Can't get a job. Take care of his family. Konnichiwa. I tried to make things work. But whatever I do, when someone comes along, they just fuck it all up. Oh yeah, nowadays you have to uh I know what you think of me. You hate me. Name the you reference. Me, don't you? I speak Say that it. language. You hate me! Weebanese. Fellas Weebanese. Uh, what am I doing? What am I doing? What have I done? <laughs> they should have had him say that. I'm sorry. You know I love you, don't you? They should have had him you say it, dude. You. What have I done? Okay. Alright, knock this on out. Means glory to pancakes? Oh fuck yeah, dude. Wait, where do I deposit the package? Right here? No. Where do I deposit it? Oh, wait, 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 wait. It's in here. Nope, deposit package. Where's the package go? Seems like people don't know what the heck I'm saying. <laughs> hey, look, man, I don't know. I remember, I remember the other night, you and uh, Pixel had to break down something or other about Japanese culture. Oh, it was waifu, I believe. Carl, wake your ass up, boy. Good morning, Carl. Good morning. It's 10 a.m. Good morning, Carl. The weather is partly cloudy, 54 degrees, 80% oh. humidity with a strong possibility of afternoon showers. It sounds like a good day to spend in bed. I did go to pick up the paint that you ordered. Oh, yes, I've forgotten. That is the difference between you and me, right, Marcus? You never forget anything. Show me your arm, please, Carl. No. Carl. Carl. Thank you. Hmm. I just opened my eyes and I'm already gritting my teeth. Humans are such a fragile machine. They break down so quickly. All this effort to keep them going. What happened to your clothes? Oh, it's nothing. Carl, get your ass up. In the street, Carl. <laughs> what a bunch of idiots. 
They think they can stop progress by roughing up a few androids. Imagine if Marcus was a uh, good character. I hope they didn't know you. Oh, no, no. They just pushed me around, Carl. Oh, I'm fine. Just pushed okay. me around, Carl. I'm fine. I'll take you to the bathroom now. I know, Jen. Oh. Bring him up. Mark is a good character. <laughs> you remember we tried to drop him on like the second playthrough of this game? And literally he just freezes in place. Unable to do so. Anything special on the agenda today? Yes, there's the opening of your retrospective at the Museum of Modern. Brags about knowing German. Gallup I wish you could drop four Carl messages in Mark's asking story to confirm right here. your attendance. I know. We're gonna try and end his and Carl's yet. story as soon as possible. We'll see about that later. But we'll see. Okay. What else? Watch me like just your usual fan mail. I've I'll miss the opportunity to kill them all. Hmm. Any news from Leo? This chat is me telling my jokes and cartoonists with World no, War II. No, I can call him if you like. I mean, that's what you want, isn't it? Remember last no, time you were, uh... You were complaining that you were the only one in it. I feel like you need at least one other person to be, like, the foil so you can just tell your jokes. I'm so starving. they're just kind of, like, doing their thing. Well, your breakfast is ready. Bacon and eggs, just the way you like them. Thank you, Marcus. You're welcome. I was have so many chairs. And clearly nobody comes to his house. 10 out of 10 best let's play. Yes! Score! I was just saying. Get facts, bitch. Well, comedy ain't good with all other people around. Well. I feel like you write comedy or like the routines when you're by yourself though, right? So it has to originate somewhere without people being there to experience it the first Thank time. Thank you, Marcus. Television. I called a personality. Horrible, I know. Why don't you find something to do while I finish my breakfast? Sure. Why don't you fuck okay, off and let me just stand here? How about that? How do I have to do something? That's uh, a fast thing to do. You could play the piano. Oh, wait. I didn't read a book. That's the one thing I haven't done. Let's read Shakespeare. Yes, you must be a comedian. I don't come up with jokes, you really? Marlon. You just come uh, back to my head. It's one of the books it. you recommended. So you're more like a so uh, situational Human comedian. Human emotions Understand that. are I'm much the same way. Though I can't. Wow, what say a terrible that thing having a personality. Humans don't understand. I uh, know. They rule our lives, and we have no idea why they make us feel like yeah, beggars right. or kings. Having to connect Life to people. Life without emotions wouldn't be worth living. One day I won't be here to take care of you anymore. You'll have to protect Not yourself. Just hiding behind. Make your choices. Quips. Decide who you not. are. And want to become. And bad jokes. This world doesn't like those who are different, Marcus. Don't let anyone. Does knowing a lot about be. World War II count as a personality? Um. Let's go to the studio. Let's see. Let's go to the studio. Presses all the wrong buttons. Jesus. There we go. Oh, 
Well, I have a personality, but again, it was just a joke. Let's see where we left off. <laughs> well, personality Remove is the joke. Sheet. And Red Dead Redemption 2 on these streams without that kind of don't know what to discuss. You can discuss whatever you wish, sir. Whether it be joking or serious. Immediately starts talking about waterboarding. Oh. <laughs> Clean the studio. genius that is the Trelawney picture. The Trelawney picture does look nice. Not gonna lie about that. Nazi officer burning a Jewish book. Yikes. See, that didn't work out too well for them in the end. No silly Germans. When will they learn? Alright, have I not cleaned this yet? Okay. Captures elegance and beauty within the suit alone. So... What's your verdict, Marcus? The, I'm not programmed to criticize art. I, the hat tip you would be a much dominant in confidence. <laughs> the truth is, I have nothing left to say uh, anymore. Each day that goes by brings me closer to the end. I'm just an old man clinging to his brushes. Oh. Carl. Oh, but enough about me. Yeah, he's going to die. Let's see if you have any talent. Give it a try. Try painting something. Button mashing. Paint? But would I... Painting what? Anything you want. Give it a try. <sighs> While the man alone combines all four and the mustache captures the thirst from the opposite gender. <laughs> In the same... I ain't discriminating. I got you. It's the thirst stash. Uh, give me that paint statue. Boom. So the Germans, when they learn, we know a lot about you. Oh my god. Say it ain't so. That is the genius that of the picture. That is a perfect thinking. copy. See, I never looked Reality. that far into it, but I mean, it absolutely makes complete not sense now. Replicating the world. See, that's why I'm not an art critic, because I just see it, I'm like, oh, that's a nice painting. Showing something it's a nice drawing. See. And then real critics come Calm by and break down. it down. Think I can do that? It's not in my program. I... Go on, go. That's why people can't resist the pimp picture. It's true. It's probably people can't resist Trelawney in general. Do something for me. Close your eyes. Close your eyes. Trust me. Trust me. Try to imagine something that doesn't exist. Something you've never seen. Now concentrate. He's like a unicorn. <laughs> how it makes you feel. And let your hand drift across the canvas. Pressing it while it's not working. No. Okay. I mean, he gives advice to a group called the discouraged men. Even Arthur got dumped. He gives advice to them. Gas chamber for you. No. Not the gas chambers. 
god, that is a depressing picture. Oh my god. Hey, it's our favorite boy. It's our favorite son. Hey, Dad. Leo. I didn't hear you come in. No, I was in the neighborhood. I thought I'd stop by. It's been a while, right? You all right? You don't look so good. Oh, yeah, yeah, I'm fine. <laughs> hey, listen, uh, I need some cash, Dad. Again? What happened to the money I just gave you? Uh, well, it's, it just goes, you know? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, you're on it again, aren't you? No. No, <laughs> you're no, on I swear. It again, aren't you? No, don't lie to me, Leo. What difference does it make? I just need some cash. That's all. Sorry. The answer is no. What? Why? You know why. Yeah, yeah, I think I do know why. <laughs> you'd rather you'd rather take care of your uh, plastic toy here than your own son, right? Tell me, Dad, what's what's it got that I don't? It's smarter, more obedient, not like me, right? But you know what? This thing is not your son. It's a fucking machine. Leo, Whoa. that's enough. Leo, that's enough. Enough, Leo. Leo. You don't care about anything except yourself and your goddamn paintings. Oh. You've never loved anyone. You've Dropping never loved some me. GDs yet. over here. You BRB is right as crackhead is. <laughs> hey, Vsauce, Michael here. <laughs> uh, you know, we share the same last name, but he spells it the incorrect way. Spell it the right way. Anyways, BRB. I. You fingers. <laughs> Boy, these loading screens. Do you want my head delivered to your door in a box? Absolutely. Damn, Ziggin. You serious? Still loading. Hey, Vsauce Michael here. When will you die? I used to watch Vsauce videos all the time, too. I just fell off for some reason. Nigga, is you serious with this right now? I have to reboot the whole fucking thing. Fuck! Uh, it's like this game didn't want me to have the platinum. I wish he still made them. Yeah, doesn't he like do stuff that's on like the premium channel or whatever now? Not exactly sure. It's 
saw him on H3, H3 not too long ago. Yeah, yeah, Quantic Dream. Hey, Daniel, how's it going, bud? Already right. back? That was a short break, but I'm glad to... Oh. It was a short break. I wouldn't have closed the game to begin with, but, you know, it crashed. Doing good? Glad to hear. I'm doing just fine, actually. Doing just fine and dandy. Just trying to get the uh, platinum for uh, Detroit here. I'm doing the uh, all Connor death run. So he does a show called Minefield on YouTube Premium. Got you. Hey Vsauce, I go here. Is that anything like his old show or no? All right, here we go. We're back to using Connor now. We gotta kill him as many times as possible. No androids allowed. No dog. That was the last trophy you had to get before platinum. Nice. Was it hard? Is there any chance? Like, did you mess it up at all on your first run, or was it pretty easy to kill him? My name is Connor. Mr. I'm Anderson. sent by Cyberlife. I looked for you at the station, but nobody knew where you were. They said you were probably having a drink nearby. I was lucky to find you at the fifth bar. What do you want? You were assigned a case early this evening. A homicide involving a Cyberlife android. In accordance with procedure, the company oh, has allocated a specialized to model to assist investigators. Okay. Well, I don't need any assistance. Especially not from a plastic asshole like you. Oh. Just be a good little robot and get the fuck out of here. Daniel, do you watch? Lieutenant Anderson, do I must inform you that I intend to file a report on your behavior. <laughs> I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I must insist. My instructions stipulate that I have to accompany you. You know where you can stick your instructions? <laughs> no. I've seen his intro compilation. <laughs> Never mind. His old stuff was good. Spill his drink. Oh, what a dick. I think we can go now. You little prick. What a dick. stopping me from knocking you out. Your sense of duty, Lieutenant. And the cost of repairs if you damage me. For your information, I'm worth a small fortune. Wonders of technology. They can even program assholes these days. Damn, dude. That was fucked up. Gotta go. Vsauce has joined the chat. Calls. Dude, if that was the case, man, I'd get a whole bunch of subs off that, probably. So now I gotta find this guy. Cause I know that he can kill Connor later. You wait here. I won't be wrong. No way. I'm coming with you. Listen. You really have to stop pissing me off if you want to make it through the rest of the night in one piece. <laughs> you can the car immediately. Can you confirm that this is a homicide? I'm not confirming anything. Have they said anything? Leave the chat if you have not watched v sauce. Do not listen to the cartoonist. It's with me. He 
He's pissed off. You don't but he's talk, still got you don't me. touch anything, and you stay out of my way. Got it? Got it. Even at Hank, we were starting to think you weren't gonna show. Yeah, that was the plan till this asshole found me. <laughs> so, you got yourself an Android, huh? Oh, very funny. Just tell me what happened. We had a so, call around eight from the landlord. The tenant hadn't paid his rent for a few months, so he thought he drove by. Just so he on. Can I not fucking see? That's when he found the body. You're a part yeah. of his cult. It's even worse before we open the windows. We move. The victim's name's Carlos Ortiz. He has a record for theft and aggravated assault. Are you enjoying the story of this? You've never played this game? Well, my other playthroughs are better than this. This is going to be like the worst possible scenario to play through. They hardly ever saw. Uh, Certainly enjoy this. Calling song. everybody out in the middle of the night. Get away. I enjoyed playing through the first two or three times. I think I played through twice. I'd say he's been there for a good three weeks. We'll know more when the coroner gets here. There's a kitchen knife over here, probably the murder weapon. Any sign of a break? In. in. Nope. The landlord said the front door was locked from the inside. All the windows were boarded up. The killer must have gone out the back way. What do we know about his Android? Not much. The neighbors confirmed he had one, but it wasn't here when we arrived. I, I gotta get some air. Make yourself at home. I'll be outside if you need me. There's nothing in here, if I remember correctly. Yeah. The Eden Club. Oh, yeah. The Eden Club. Can't wait to get to that part. Tracy's. Come on through here. This letter is perfect. It's way too neat. No human. I'm back. Nice hey, EGS. EGS is back. Chris, was this written in the victim's blood? I would say so. Perfection. We're taking samples for analysis. <laughs> no, we're not at the Eden Club yet. But we will be. We will be. I'm trying to like speed run some of this evidence if I can. Robot strippers. Hells yeah, my dude. Code Vein is Milano? I do not. What is Code Vein? Deviant was attacked. Emotional shock. Eight of ten. Red ice. Seems our friend Carlos liked the party. Carlos liked the party. Let's see here. BRB. All right, cartoonist. Chris, I want full analysis on the narcotics. Consider it done, Lieutenant. Like shall we say? Hey, Mike, you finished taking samples there? Yeah, that's it. Life sands. This dude got. Did not have a good day. Red ice. So he's on the drugs. Five foot six. A short little fella. Stabbed a shit ton of times. There's something in his hand. Stabbed him a bunch. Turn the camera. 
box there. It came from the kitchen. Why does that guy look like Jack Black if his acting career didn't take off? Facts. Times. Yeah. Seems like the killer really had it in for him. Have you awakened any of your characters yet? Uh, you mean made them deviant? Is that what you're talking about? I have on my original playthrough, uh, not yet. We haven't gotten to that part on this story yet. I think that's what you're talking about. Oh, in Black Desert, I mean. Uh, no, I don't even know what that is, to be honest with you. I don't know what awakens means. I haven't, I haven't got that far in Black Desert yet. All right, we got all the evidence. Yay! And he's up there. Yay! Is she talking about being awoken? I know that's what I thought. That was my initial uh, instinct as well. Awoken. Can I like give you the evidence, Lieutenant? I think I figured out what happened. Level 58 oh, characters yeah. can awaken now. Yeah, I, I'm not all that level. Ears. I'm not that high. It all started in the kitchen. In the kitchen. There are obvious signs of a struggle. Question is, what exactly happened here? Come to the open side. I think the victim attacked the android with a bat. With the bat. That lines up with the evidence. Go on. Android stabbed the victim. So the android was trying to defend itself, right? Okay, then what happened? The victim fled to the living room. The living room. He stabbed the fuck out of that guy. And he tried to get away from the android. All right, that makes sense. The android murdered the victim with the knife. With the knife. Okay. Your theory's not totally ridiculous, but it doesn't tell us where the android went. It was damaged by the bat and lost some Ethereum. Lost some. This version of Jack Black is Ethereum. The <laughs> you call it blue blood. It's the fluid that powers androids' bio components. It evaporates after a few hours and becomes invisible to the naked eye. Oh, but I bet you can still see it, can't you? Correct. Yeah. All right, let's go find them. Turn yourself in. You're under arrest. So much for him being in Jumanji. Dude, him being in Jumanji is hilarious. Especially when he was acting as that, uh, that woman. It's pretty funny. Nope, I don't even know who that. Oh, fuck. Fine, I'll open it. God. Nothing. So I need to see that there's no ladder. There used to be a ladder here. Okay, I'm back. Hey, cartoonist is back. Hello, boy. Did you finally watch Far From Home yet? I did. I did. Not watch it. I still have not watched it. Need a chair. Take the chair. Hey, 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 what are you doing with that chair? I'm going to check something. Says the psychopath. Uh, check something. Glad he's gone. <laughs> this is genuine, then the knot came in. <laughs> <laughs> uh, 
All right, Connor, me boy, let's go. Deviant located. Maybe gone it's for just an extension of time. Huh? Alrighty, man. Well, hopefully, we'll see you in the next stream if you don't come back in time. I'm begging you. You socialize with people don't on PlayStation me. today. People are on. Connor, what the fuck is going on up there? It's here, Lieutenant! Oh, shit. Chris! Ben! Get your asses in here now! Come on! I like the music on this part, very cinematic. I think the score for this entire game is pretty well done. Found the Deviant. Alright, so I know that that guy can kill me later. Soldiers attack you? Yeah. Dinner is ready. Yeah, yeah, I'm coming. The stream is loading. Uh, it says everything's good on my end. Oops, I couldn't. Let me know if it's still messing up. Never mind. Is it good now? It says everything on my side is good for 1080p, 60 frames. So now it's goose. Oh my god, it's goose now. Oh. There wasn't much in the kitchen. I did what I could. She made a spaghetti. Turn on the light. So Alice is a robot, does she actually eat the food that's prepared? I lost my job because of androids. Why is it not working? Turn it. Then I need somebody to take care of this goddamn house. What do I do? Go out and hire a fucking android. I think it's just your internet that did that? Okay. Well, keep me posted. Also, everybody feel free to also comment whether the stream is looking like shit right now. Of course, androids are so fucking wonderful. Who was the message Stop from? Stop moving around, for Christ's sake! Uh, making John me Martin. Nervous. He said that he needed my help if I could join. What are you looking at? What's your fucking problem? Not the life you dreamed of, eh? Maybe you think this is easy. Maybe you think it's my fault we live in this fucking shithole. My fault your fucking mother took off. You should stop taking drugs, Todd. Sometimes you really scare me, Todd. Fucking bitch took off without a word. Fucking whore walked out on me for a fucking account. It's all your fault. Daddy, no. It's all your fucking fault. He slapped the fuck out of her, dude. Get back here. Come back here? Come back here right now! It's all her fault. I know it's her fault. You 
stay there. Don't you dare fucking move, or I'll bust you worse than last time. Let me move. I shall break my coding. I think you realize we're gonna have to see slot code and warfare a third time. Fuck yeah. Oh wait. You might not. I think they might die before that. Fucking Zlatko. Zlatko sucks, bro. Hate that guy. Reason with Todd, man. Fuck Todd, bro. Hey Todd, you fucking suck. Come on, Kara. Kara Zorel. Let's go. Where is she? Come on. Wherever. He's coming. He's gonna hurt me. No, he ain't. Come on. Get out. Get away, or he's gonna break you like last time. Why'd she do that? You're coming with me. Daddy's very mad, Alice. Very mad. Not in another room. Why couldn't I go out the window? It's all her fault. It's all her fucking fault. Baking down the highway? Yeah. Am I supposed to let go of this shit? Or like, what the fuck is going on? Is he gonna walk back by or... Come out of there right now. Let's go. Life is a oh god. Open door. You not know how doors work. You gotta take the locks off. Oh shit. Oh shit. Oh, I'm just back. Go out the fucking door. Run away. That was super anticlimactic. The first time we had like get in a full on twelve round bout with that guy. You have to obey me. You're mine. Then you kill him then? Yeah, you shoot him and he dies in there. <laughs> it's like, oops. I thought I could have went through the window, but I guess I messed up. Alright. Making progress. Oh, here we go. We get to kill your boy. <laughs> that was by far the most boring party I've been to in the last 25 years. Every time I go to one of these, I ask myself, what the hell am I doing here? I hate cocktail parties and all the schmoozers that go there. Well, it's a chance for all those people who admire your work to meet you. Yeah, yeah, yeah. No one gives a damn about what was a great astral chain. All they care about is how much money they're gonna make. Carl or the crackhead. I'm Come assuming on, she's talking about astral chain. This whole thing has made me thirsty. I asked myself that the last time I went to a Scott to a need as usual. Absolutely. What a gentle Okay, lad. but you know what your doctor would say. Yeah, well, he can kiss my ass. I'm old enough to choose my own medication. That boy. Did you leave the light on in the studio? Uh-oh. No, no, I'm sure I didn't. Call the police. Detroit police, what's your emergency? 
This is Carl Manfred's android at 8941 Lafayette Avenue. We've just returned home and found the lights on. There may have been a break in. A patrol car is on the way. These guys become sentient like that. Yeah, when they're when they're like something uh I guess triggering emotionally comes up, they have to make a decision and they uh, break their code or whatever. <laughs> he just keeps saying what was just Leo, over and over again. What are you doing? So what are we doing? Carl or Leo? Myself. It's crazy what some people pay for this shit. Don't touch them. Look, they're all gonna be mine sooner or later anyway. Just think of it as a down payment on my inheritance. Marcus, get him away from there. Get him out of here. Be reasonable. This isn't gonna get you anywhere. Kill the all you ever do is tell me to go away. What's wrong, Dad? I'm not good enough for you? I'm not perfect like this fucking thing? That's enough! Get out! Right now! What makes what? it so special Ooh. anyway, huh? What's it got that I don't Leave him alone! <laughs> Come on! <laughs> I love how he like pushes him and he just like kind of slides away in his wheelchair. Don't yourself, you hear me? <laughs> don't do anything. Go ahead, hit me. <laughs> you fucking good man. Bitch. Act like one. You like Marcus? Stop it. Doesn't matter too much of a pussy. Stop it, Leo! Stop it! Just scared to fight back, you fucking bitch! <laughs> you fucking bitch! <laughs> you fucking bitch! <laughs> oh my god, dude! It's so good. <laughs> Don't make him fight back. Oh, right, that's right. I forgot you're not a real person. You're just a fucking piece of plastic. No, Leo, leave him alone. Listen, no. I'm gonna destroy you. And then it'll just be me and my dad. I'm gonna tear you apart. And nobody. <laughs> oh, you fucking bitch. So he is a crackhead? Get it? Leo. Got him. Oh my god. Leo. My little boy. Carl. <laughs> also, this is the fuck North run. They'll destroy well. you, Marcus. Hashtag blame North. You gotta go. Get out of here. <laughs> Fuck you, little boy. Carl, no. No, please, I don't want to leave you. Please, I can't. I don't want to leave you. Get out! Now! Go! Marcus! Don't fucking move! And Marcus is down. I forgot about Blame North. I know. The Blame North movement is in full effect now. Okay, I need to calm down. No, Marcus. Alright, here we go. Alright, alright. What happened before you took that night? I gotta concentrate now, guys. Can't mess it up. How long were you in the attic? Get fucked. Why didn't you even try to run away? Don't worry, Pixel. You see God Marcus damn it. again. <laughs> Fuck it. I'm out of here. We're wasting our time interrogating a machine. We'll get nothing out of it. You always try roughing it up a little. After all, it's not human. Why does Android's nothing not ever human. come of that guy's story? You would only damage it, and that wouldn't make it talk. Deviants also have a tendency to stop. Like he's throughout the entire game. Situation. Okay, smartass. And nothing ever becomes of it. What should we do then? I could try questioning it. <laughs> <laughs> what do we have to lose? Go ahead. Suspect's all yours. He doesn't deserve any more screen time. 
I think I like Connor the best. Connor and Kara. I feel like Con uh, Kara's storyline is like too small though. Like they don't give her enough to do. When you play Marcus the nice guy, I think he's a decent character, but he's still not great. Sit down. Connor is awesome. I like Connor a lot. I like his voice actor too. I don't like Connor too much. You're not gonna like Connor for sure on this playthrough because I'm like literally trying to get him killed every opportunity I can. So, guess pixel eye. <laughs> How both of you are reacting. <laughs> <laughs> he wants to have holding hand sex with North. He really does, like all the time. How can you say that? I don't think. Well, she hasn't seen much of Connor up to this point, so. I detect an instability in your program. It can trigger an unpleasant feeling, like fear in humans. You're damaged. Did your owner do that? Did he beat you? You've refused to talk since they arrested you. He always if you don't cooperate, his they'll missions. do things the hard way. Is that what you want? If you won't talk, I'm going to have to probe your memory. No! No, please don't do that. That seems like what? an ass already. What are they gonna do to me? They're gonna destroy me, aren't they? They're going to disassemble you to look for problems in your bio components. They have no choice if they want to understand what happened. Why did you tell them you found me? Why couldn't you just have left me there? You think Marcus seems cool now? Wait till you see him here in a minute when he gets his cool ass coat. I was programmed to hunt deviants like you. I just accomplished my mission. I always accomplish I my die. mission. Then talk to me. I. I... <laughs> you were always like a sister to me. I can't. Hit her with the Anakin. You turned her against me! You leave me no choice. Teach you to look me in the eye. I accessed its memory. I know what happened. Hmm. What the fuck is it? It's doing? destroying itself. down again like how did he shoot him perfectly in the head and his eyes were like either closed or beaten out of his no not Connor I know it pains me to see Connor get killed so many times but it's literally the last trophy I have to get I hate it so much <laughs> I do not like it at all but it 
must be done. He dies like a bitch in these. We're killing him on purpose though. Like if I was, technically I'm playing the game incorrectly. That Connor said, like, watch my first playthroughs, or my second playthrough. My second playthrough is better than my first. Connor is like my favorite character in this. Thank you for using Detroit buses. <laughs> Wait months for a PlayStation that's in the Detroit Platinum Avatar. All right. End the line. End of the line. Yeah, you're gonna have to leave. Let's go. Wake Come up. on. Wake up, Alice. We have to go. <laughs> Even the hate one oh, Fuck Marcus. <laughs> oh yeah, Connor's the best. I mean, you can't compare Marcus to Connor. Compare him to North. North is the worst. Everybody hates North. I don't think anybody likes North. Nope, don't say anything. Just keep going. I wage war. <laughs> Pixel has been north this whole time. <laughs> oh no. We'll find somewhere to spend the night. His death proves he's all that's It all makes sense now. Alright, well, let's... Where's the, uh... Come on, Alice, we've gotta hurry. Sleep in the car. Blame North. Hashtag blame North. Don't you go over there. Uh, North is a girl. You have not seen North yet. You'll see her soon, though. Get your ass up. Get up! Oh my god, I can't believe you. Alice, you're freezing cold. I'm okay. I'm, I'm not so cold. What have I done? You look lost. We have nowhere to go. Assuming genders. I don't know, Pixel. How dare you. How dare you. It's almost 2020, assuming genders. But that's on the other side of town. We need a place for tonight. Come on, Alice. Now, the guy in the wheelchair, his name is Carl. And his dead son's name is Leo. Get fucked, Leo. You fucking suck. <laughs> Alright, let's hide in the car. I think sleeping in the car is the fastest way to get through this. Although I do love robbing the convenience store. You fucking bitch! <laughs> he punched the shit out of Marcus. <laughs> you fucking bitch. What's that? It looks abandoned. Stand back, Alice. I love how she hit it twice and then said stand back. Like, what if you would have broken on the first one? It'd been like, oh yeah, also it was already unlocked. <laughs> Bust it out the window. Come on. It's dry inside, and nobody will find us here. I don't want to sleep in there. I don't care, Can get in we there. find a better place? No. Stay here. We're better off staying, Alice. I love you too, North. The important thing is for us to be safe. And it's just for tonight. Alright, close this. 
Oh, she is upset with me. Yikes. Madam President! <laughs> Madam President! Um, EGS, I'll make you my cum man slut. That a boy, EGS. Why was she always so upset with me? The Trelawney pimp had his working. All I wanted was a life like other girls. Maybe I did something wrong. Maybe I wasn't good enough. That's why he was always so angry. Mm -hmm. I just wanted us to be a family. I just wanted him to love me. Why can't we just be happy? Mm. I don't know, Alice. You'll never leave me, right? Promise you'll never go. Alice, we don't know what's going to happen. Will we be together forever? Forever. Oh, what kind of decision was that? I, oh, that's lame. I said I can't make promises and then it made me say forever anyway. What is what even is that? A cum man slut? I'm not quite sure. It's okay, child. You talking about Alice or are you talking about EGS? Kara's abusive this time, yeah. Uh oh. Are you ready for this pixel? Here's your, uh, here's your Tom. Discount Ellie. She wishes. Oh, Alice. It's not even a discount Ellie, it's like a rip-off Ellie. New Terminator movie looks scary. Uh, oh yeah, my legs don't work, right? Yeah. There we go. So I gotta get new legs, new ears. Here's my name is Marcus. Oh yeah, the classic line. You're raging over his. My name is Marcus. Is here. Damn right he is. The man, the myth, the legend. He looks fucked up, though. Like, really bad. So edgy. <laughs> Oh, the edge has not even begun to start with Marcus yet. I don't think we we started to dislike Marcus until his edge, like his edginess started though. Like we were cool up until with Mark. Sorry, we were cool with Marcus up until this point, I believe. It's just all the stuff that he did afterwards that messed everything up, right? If I remember correctly. Cause like he did seem like a pretty nice, chill android. So many button prompts. So many. Into her palms, yeah. They have android sex so many times, too. 
like once they decide to do it, like they just walk up to each other with people watching them and shit. They just like, oh, time to touch hands. This is a place where we can be free. I'm jealous. Of Oh my goodness, this part is like Luke on Dagobah. Or Starkiller on Dagobah. <laughs> No, she said find Jericho, like the walls of Jericho. Oh, Where shit. are you going? Incompatible, you are worthless to me. Yeah, he should be tossing niggas too, which is fucked up. Yeah, both of them. Oh, yeah, this shit doesn't work. Fuck off. I think this one works, if I'm not mistaken. Yep. Jericho. Hello. I'm an AK-700 Android. I was designed to serve you. You know his real age now? What's his real age? Less than 18. Or negative 18. I can see clearly now, I have a new eye. Guess the truth is out now. Guys, I have been negative 18 this whole time. You lied to us. You said you were negative 6, sir. Why have you done this? He's legal in negative years. Yeah. What's the looking for again? Well, it's less than zero, so. Kill him. Nah, Carl's a, a real person. All these are androids. But seriously, the fuck is a cum man stuff? Alright, where are my freaking parts, dude? I'm tired of playing Marcus already. His son Leo is a crackhead. Ooh, you about to die, son. Nah, nigga. You wanna live? Well, so do I, bitch! The fucking Marcus is a cold-blooded killer, dog. Cold-blooded, man. Danger, shut down imminent. But what do you know? I have an arc reactor right here. A 
just little up. It's, it's like it comes slow, except I'm gonna milk you instead of you taking income. Damn, bro. <clears throat> I don't know if somebody said that to me, I'd be like, yes, please. Compatible. Oh yeah, it's about to get real loud. So if you're using headphones, I apologize. Audio warning. Here it comes. And he can be Cyborg from Teen Titans. <laughs> I'm assuming North is Raven. Dude, she's totally Raven. <laughs> God, dude, no way. And fucking, uh, what's his name? The black guy, Josh, would be Starfire, I assume. Yeah, he, he realized that's what you meant. He's making a joke. He's making it funny. She wants to milk you up your semen, so... You'll see North soon enough, trust me. You'll see her soon enough. My name is Marcus. Coming in hot. Here it comes. Get ready for this edge lordness. You are lord. Like also, why was the jacket just sitting there on that pipe? Whose idea? They're like, yo, 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 I got this perfect idea to end the scene. It's gonna be so cool, bro. Everybody's gonna love it. No, no one loved it. I want a coat like that. The coat's not bad, but it makes no sense why it's just sitting there. Hey, Connor's back. Alright, let's go find Amanda. Oh, I forgot you can't. You have to walk on the paths. <laughs> uh, yeah, you're getting joke of the night for sure, especially since Cartoonist left. He was giving you a... Uh... Yeah, Amanda is probably the worst character in this game. I really dislike her a lot. And she's not even real. Spoiler alert. Whoa, what the actual fuck? What the actual fuck? 
why was that whole ass coat on that pole? See, it made no sense. Hello, Amanda. <laughs> it was just sitting there. <laughs> Connor, it's good to see you. Your predecessor was unfortunately destroyed. It knew deviants could be unpredictable, but it wasn't careful enough. I hope you won't make the same mistake. No, we're being reckless, bro. I don't intend to. I'm trying to get killed left and right. When a Connor model is destroyed, its memory is transferred to the next one. But some <laughs> data can be lost Adoring in the fans. process. Yeah. Avoid being destroyed. It will be better for you and the investigation. Lies. I understand. The interrogation seemed challenging. What did you think of the Deviant? It could have killed everyone in the room. The previous Connor should have anticipated the danger. It was a mistake to let an armed policeman so close to the Deviant. This Lieutenant Anderson has been officially assigned to the Deviancy case. What do you make of him? Oh, dude, she is Amanda Waller from DC. He obviously That's funny. has a personal situation impacting his. Yeah, she acts just he like him. Seems to have no interest in the investigation. Unfortunately, we have no so choice much. but to work with him. <laughs> what do you think is the best approach? I will focus on the investigation and try to ignore him. As long as he doesn't interfere and we avoid conflict, he shouldn't be a problem. More and more androids show signs of deviancy. There are millions in circulation. If they become unstable, the consequences will be disastrous. You're the most advanced prototype Cyberlife has ever created. If anyone can figure out what's happening, it's you. You can count on me, Amanda. Oh, that's quite a theory, Pixel. Pick up Pixel. the investigation where the previous Connor left off. That is quite a fan this. theory, for sure. Hurry, Connor. There's little time. Hurry, Connor. Can I help you? I'm here to see Lieutenant Anderson. Do you have authorization? Yes. Oops, sorry. Lieutenant Anderson hasn't arrived yet, but you can wait at his desk. <laughs> the EGS is awful. Oh, shit. Fucking machine can kill everything in the room. Hey. You take a look at these samples yet? Lab report says they cut it with something. Oh, dang it. So I have to go to his desk. Oh, look, it's a uh, homeboy. He's following a report about Kara. I didn't even notice that the first time. That's good world building. All right, this is his desk, right? But I'm also Asian. Excuse me. Do you know what time Lieutenant Anderson usually arrives? Depends on where he was the night before. If rise up, we will not be silent. If we're lucky, we'll see him before noon. Thanks. You and you come with me. Secret Asian man. Sumo, your dog's name is Sumo. This guy. Shit. Look at that. A fucking ghost. <laughs> His clone ends up in the dumpster this morning. What do you know? Now the son of a bitch takes his place. I 
never seen an android like you before. What model are you? The asshole, I'm talking to you. Hey, bring me a coffee, dipshit. Get a move on! I gave you an order. I'm sorry, but I only take orders from Lieutenant Anderson. Oh, oh. He's <laughs> been me for being against North. North. When a human <gasps> gives you an order, EGS you is North? obey. Oh my god. Got it? Yes. Stay out of my way. Next time, you won't get off so easy. That's what she said. Hey, you. Several sources report that CyberLife has provided Detroit police with a prototype detective android. Although You're not a part of the movement. Them. Hello, hey, it's Hank. My name is Connor. Shit. I'm the android sent by CyberLife. God, I saw you get shot in the head last night. My predecessor was unfortunately destroyed, but CyberLife transferred its memory and sent me to replace it. This incident should not affect the investigation. Oh, Jesus. Hank, in my office. I've always been against her. A lesser being like North. <laughs> you guys are I've got ten them. new cases involving androids on my desk every day. According to several We've always had isolated incidents. Old ladies losing their android maids and that kind of crap. But now, we're getting reports of assaults and even homicide, like that guy last night. This isn't just Cyberlife's problem anymore. It's now a criminal investigation, and we've got to deal with it before the shit hits the fan. I want you to investigate these cases and see if there's any link. Why me? Why do I got to be the one to deal with this shit? Leaves up my face to reveal I am Connor. Give it up. I know jack shit about androids, <laughs> Jeffrey. I can barely change the settings on my own. <laughs> Everybody's overloaded. I think you're perfectly qualified for this type of investigation. <laughs> Bullshit. The truth is, nobody wants to investigate these fucking androids, and you let me hold the bag. North, give it up. I have to Cyber high ground. over this android to help with the investigation. It's a state-of-the-art prototype. It'll act as your partner. No fucking way! I don't need a partner, and certainly not this plastic prick. <laughs> you understand? Hey, you are seriously power. starting to piss me off. You are a police lieutenant. You are supposed to do what I say and shut your goddamn mouth. You know what my goddamn mouth has to say to you? Okay. Huh? Okay. I'll pretend like I didn't hear that, so I don't have to add any more pages <laughs> to your disciplinary folder, cause it already looks like a fucking novel. This conversation <laughs> is over. <laughs> Jesus Christ, why are you doing this to me? You know how much I hate these fucking things. Why are you doing this to me? Listen, I'm <sighs> a bitch. I mean, do your job or you hand in your badge. Now, if you excuse me, I've got work to do. Oh my <sighs> goodness, dude. Epic lightsaber fight between Connor and North. Well then, I won't keep you any longer. Have a nice day, Captain. <laughs> I can't. Like, just try to imagine this. Limps severed. Damn it, EGS, you fucked it up. Duel of Fates, please. I understand the destruction of my predecessor may have been unpleasant Ooh. for you, Lieutenant. I'll do everything I well, can to make sure it doesn't right happen there. again. Now that we're partners, it would be great to get to know each other better. Getting to know. Is there a desk anywhere I could use? No one's using that one. I believe I earned joke of the night. If you have any files on deviance, I'd like to take a look at them. Terminals on your desk. 
Knock yourself out. Dude, the, the, the combination of backflips and front flips do you always like just completely did time. me in. I arrive when I arrive. I made him pound Stop busting desk. my balls, okay? <laughs> oh, it was North. There she is. The beginning of Blame North. North is in those files you look at. Yep, there she is right there. <clears throat> she was a fucking sex slave. 243 files. First day back may have nine months. But the lightsaber fight continued. It all started in Detroit and quickly spread across the country. I'll actually tie you up. An AX400 is you. reported to have assaulted a man like. Hell's yeah, bro. That could be a good starting point for our investigation. Like the sex slave you are, North. <laughs> If the situation doesn't suit you, Lieutenant, you should ask to be relieved of duties and let me work with someone else. I know exactly what I have to do. So keep your advice to yourself and mind your own business. I'm about to end this old man's career. I'm oh, going to file shit. a report with my superiors that you refuse to work on this investigation. <laughs> no. This dude's about to beat the shit out of Connor. Listen, asshole. If it was up to me, I'd throw the lot of you in a dumpster and set a match to it. So stop pissing me off. But things are gonna get nasty. Lieutenant? Uh, sorry to disturb you. I have some information on the AX-400 that attacked the guy last night. It's been seen in the Ravendale district. I'm on it. You fool. Good job, Connor. He's gonna blow your head off in no time. Oh no, reverse card. Gets Thanos. Alright, so I think this is another Connor death. I believe. <clears throat> and if I play it correct, I think Kara can die here too. So we won't have to play her story anymore. Alice is distant. Yikes. Am inevitable. <laughs> I am. Am. Am inevitable. Read it, run from it. The Connor death comes all the same. Reveals back of hand. Now the way that scene should have ended is Carol Danvers should just float over. It's like, why don't I just do it? And she just snaps like a thousand times and doesn't get weaker and just cleans up the entire universe. EGS slash North snapped away. So here's what I never understood. Why is she cutting her hair if her hair isn't real? Like when she turns back into her like white prototype thing, the, the hair doesn't like fall off her head. It just completely disappears. So I don't understand it. Let's just finish it. Also, never understood why taking that out matters at all. I mean, obviously, if it's gone, they can't tell if you're human or not, but... Maybe that's the reason they did it, I guess. <clears throat> okay, so now... New clothes. Alright. 
Where are the nipples? Police patrolling the area. Where are the clothes at? Over here. That's a magazine. Clothes. Oh god, there's a person. Does Connor have a break-free moment as well? Uh, you have to play Connor a specific way, and the way that we've played him so far, uh, that will not be possible, I believe. But yeah, Connor can become, uh, deviant. It's at his, when he becomes deviant, it's actually pretty cool. And he actually gets to do some pretty cool fight scenes as well. Looks like a badass. So we've had a Detroit Become Human, Marvel, Star Wars, meme-worthy crossover. Combining some anime themes here and there. Now we just need to get somebody to animate it all. Place it on YouTube, get a million gajillion views. No one will recognize me now. Alright, let's wake the fucking kid up. Oops. Gotta be shit. Alright, kiddo. I don't know how to animate yet. EGS becomes a full employee of uh, the Mulatto Alice. Gamer channel. Wake up, Alice. You mean she gets a sweet jacket as well? Fuck yeah, dude. Look at that jacket. Wasn't a night. No, her jacket's weak sauce. No. That's where the police no, are doing this on purpose. How do you feel? I'm cold. It all comes together. What are we gonna do now? Die. We that die. android we saw yesterday, he gave me an address. He said we could get help there. The train passes just on the other side of the road. Mm -hmm. The station mm -hmm. can't be far. You feel okay to walk a little? Let's go then. Fuck your goal, so discount Ellie. Dude, she's not discount Ellie. She's more like a fucking discount AJ from Walking Dead. Dude sucked. Fucking AJ. You're pretty like that. You really look like a human now. It's not weird to say at all. Can I not go through this way? Cops are gone. Let's go. Wait, no, no. At least we're on our trail. All right, that's all for now. It's Anderson. Ready to go. He saved Clem, well, but Clem would have never been in that situation if she didn't have to take care okay, of AJ. Well, okay. Turn anything up. If Clem was fending for herself, she'd have been that? like the best ever. I have no idea. It took the first bus that came along and stayed at the end of the line. Its decision wasn't planned; it was driven by fear. Androids don't feel fear. Deviants do. They get overwhelmed by their emotions and make kill Kara and Kara, the only good characters. Facts. All right, well, that still doesn't tell us where it went. It didn't have a plan, and it had nowhere to go. Maybe it didn't go far. Maybe it's Maybe. still here.
I don't want anyone to die besides Connor. Well, if I don't kill people off, it's gonna make this playthrough significantly longer. So, if I fuck it up, they may not die. But we'll see. North, how dare you? <laughs> Shut it, North. You don't see me? Shit, that's them! Stop! Quick, call it in! We saw them headed for the train station. Go, my boy. Go, my boy! Run, Connor! Run like the wind! Come on, mate. You got this. I love how Hank didn't even try. But Connor's like, I fucking got this one. I'm gonna be a legend. They're over there! Why didn't you follow them, you idiot? Up, up! Get him, Connor! Get up! Get up! Climb the fence! Climb the fence! Don't shoot! We need it alive! Oh god. Alright, don't get hit. Oh, please don't let me get hit. Please don't let me get hit. Oh, fuck. That's insane. I'm fast as fuck, boy. Oh god. Oh god. Oh shit. Oh boy. Woo! Hey, where are you going? Come on, Connor. I can't let them get away. They Come on, Connor. They'll never make it to the other side. I can't take that chance. Now you will get yourself killed. Connor! Get off me, nigga. God damn it! Let's go. Let's go, Connor! down for the count. Is she gonna get hit? Oh, I ain't gonna lie, seeing them two die was kind of rough. Damn. Ah. <laughs> Milano, what the fuck? Hey, look, okay, look, all right. I didn't design the, the game for that to happen. Kara and Alice died on the highway. Fuck, dude. But with Luther, they do. Several sources report that <laughs> hey, yo, you know my boy Luther still gonna commit suicide. Although police assistant androids have existed for several years now. Hey, we're back to my name is Marcus. I had to kill them to short the playtime of the game. Their chapters do absolutely nothing for this trophy, so if I kill them, I don't have to play them anymore. I had to avoid Zlatko at all costs. Spoilers, Daniel. Spoilers. But yeah, no. She's a little robot. They're both robots. They're not real. Yeah, fuck Alice. <laughs> uh. Oops, sorry. <laughs> Daniel has been banned. Just kidding. Oh, battery level low. 
Spare some change? I'm mad. Spare some change? It's like from, uh, what was that, the South Park episode? You have any change? Spare some change? <laughs> I'm proud. Dude, also, those cars were going so fucking fast. That's how you know they were anim uh, automated? Yeah, automated. I didn't kill a child, okay? I didn't kill the child. It was the driver who saw her coming and was like, nope, I am not being late to work. And just fully mowed down that small child. I'm too far away. Are you kidding me? Don't drink and drive, children. Don't run across a busy highway either. You know the purpose of the skill check or a quick time event. I'm arresting you. <gasps> You're arresting me? Ma nah, I didn't purposely fail those. I'm just terrible at video games. Why am I still going? What the fuck, man? I literally saw you not even try. I tried! I'm just no good. I'm, I'm terrible at video games, okay? I have to go underneath the fence. I was looking at chat, and then next thing I know... Liar! I was looking at chat, and then, you know, next thing I know, Carl's getting hit by a freaking car, and it's too late. Don't get arrested by Pixel. I sense the lustful desires. Emitting from Pixel, be safe. Mmm. Lustful desires, you say. Nah, I think she's after you, my guy. She don't want to have anything to do with me. That's a police jacket? FBI open up. Is it a police jacket? No. Confirmed. Confirmed Marcus is working for the feds. Is she now? Oh yeah, dude. She clearly wants some of the EGS, and only the EGS. EGS has all the juice, all the max sauce. And then I gotta hop my ass up there. Oops. Use this. I'm after both of you. Ayo! Now it's a party. To Mulatto. Liar! Nah, bro, you got all the gas. I'm just your wingman. You feel me? I got you, bro. I'm gonna carry you to victory. You turned her against me! <laughs> Alright Marcus, time to do some hardcore parkour. Up, up. Up, up. Oh yeah. You will not take her from me! Hey, look, man, I just said she's all yours, man. She clearly wants you. She just said she wants both of us so that we'll fight over her. That's how they do. They want to be coveted, and then they'll take the winner. Humans are more animalistic than you think. Boom. Boom. Where's the last one? Uh... There it is. I have brought peace, freedom, justice, and security to my new empire. Wait, what? 
<laughs> I, w I wish that's exactly how the movie went. I Anakin said all of that, and then Obi Wan was like, "Wait, what?" He's so fucking dumb. If you're not with me, then you're you're me enemy. You're me enemy. Oops. Don't do that. There you go, the ladder. Compute. No, I'm actually after both of you. You're both cute and friendly. Aww. Well, thank you. You will try. Backflips. <laughs> oh, I love it. The Anakin yell with front flips, though, is like my new favorite now. It's so good. Alright, come on, Marcus. Let's find Jericho, bud. I'll backflip it in your lap. How about that? Fuck yeah, dude. Let's do it. I don't know. I might be a ride that you won't survive. Footage of Mavado cheating. Busted. I survived a lap jump into nine inches. What about 10? You know what I'm saying? Oh, really? God, dude, I hate Marcus. I could probably go 13. Fuck yeah, dude. It's a party now. <laughs> Just keep saying, oh, really? <laughs> uh... Now, I guess the question, the question me and EGS just have to settle it. Who, is who goes first, or do we go at the same time? Look, man, as long as we don't lock eyes, I'm cool with going at the same time. You just pick a hole and go to town, but... <laughs> What has this stream become? Look how it says jump and he literally just falls off the edge. Like there was no effort to jump. Stream, what have I done? <laughs> YouTube didn't like the word cum slut. Why did it block it? Right. Oh, I don't know why I did that. It blocked it, that's fine. Hey, you get some flashlight. It likes it now. <laughs> oh yeah. Jump scare coming in hot. Oh, wait, I'm about to open this first. Oh, no, no, no. Oh. 
Let's go, Marcus. You stoic, silent protagonist, you. Yeah, it doesn't like people saying mulatto for some reason. Sometimes I can type it, sometimes other people can type it, and sometimes it's like, nope. That is a racial slur. And I'm like, fuck you, you do. <laughs> do you wonder what mulatto means? Really? It's just the offspring of a black person and a white person. Because I am half black and half white. Also, hence my logo, black and white. Welcome to Jericho. Welcome to Jericho. Shut up, Simon. I'm killing you as well. <laughs> Wait, really? Yeah. Now you can go in and tell your teacher you learned something. Wow, really? So nobody knew what mulatto meant? <laughs> uh, that's funny. Uh, no, mulatto is specifically black and white. There you go. A person of mixed white and black ancestry, especially a person with white. With one oh, white thanks. and one black parent. Hey, Hank. Hey. How you doing? Uh, you know, same old shit. Usual? Yeah. Connor, let's go! A video lied to me. Sorry, Lieutenant. It took me a while to find you. Are you gonna come back like this every time you get killed? My predecessor was unfortunately destroyed. But Cyberlife transferred its memory and sent me to replace it. This incident should not affect the investigation. Not affect the investigation? I just saw you get hit by a truck! Now you come back like nothing happened? A machine was destroyed. And another machine was sent to replace it. I don't you understand what fucking cocks. Okay, fuck you. <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> Dude is so mad. I just got a report of a suspected deviant. It's a few blocks away. We should go have a look. I'll let you finish your meal. I'll be in Fuck the car you. if you need me. <laughs> Fuck you. Hey, Connor. You run out of batteries or what? I'm sorry. I was making a report to Cyberlife. Uh, well, do you plan on staying in the elevator? No. I'm coming. Why oh, was this thing turning yellow? Um, hey, what do we know about this guy? So like their thing Not turns much. yellow like when they're like Just thinking about something or whether they're like from this floor. Nobody's supposed uh, to be living here, but the neighbor said saw a man hiding an LED under his couch. And it turns red when they're in Christ, danger. If we have to investigate like every time scared there's some strange like noise, we're going to need more cops. Also anytime he's like uh, relaying information over the internet or some shit like that, it turns yellow as well. Ew, he's coming. Anybody home? Knock, knock, motherfucker. Open up, Detroit police! It's yellow, they're in rest mode. Stay behind me. Got it. Got it. Connor sequences are so good and like how you have to do detective work. I mean, it's like super easy detective work, but still. Red means they're distressed. Get out of the fucking way. What 
What the fuck is this? The pigeons. Ooh. Ooh. Ah, Jesus, this place stinks. Well, looks like we came for nothing. Our man's gone. Now that is top joke of the night. What's <laughs> top joke of the night? Also, who's coming? YouTube won't tolerate this. Daniel's giving out a joke of the night to somebody. The rest mode one. <laughs> I'll come. Alright, you see that? Uh, EGS, Daniel gave you joke of the night. It's official. You take it. I need some fresh air. I'll come for you, dude. Well, I think you tips head. Such a gentleman. RT. Probably initials. He put his initials in his jacket? That's something your mom... Fake ID. The driver's license is fake. Cool. At least we didn't come for nothing. Oh, cool. He's up there. <laughs> I love how that shit was so black I can't even see. <laughs> That's something your mock cartoons hang out. <laughs> so real, dude. Any idea what it means? <laughs> He's like, what you were saying is real. Written 2,471 times. It's the same sign Ortiz's android wrote on the shower wall. Why are they obsessed with this sign? Looks like mazes or something. I'm winning so many jokes of the night. Yeah, for real. I'm gonna pay attention to the story now. For as much story as there's gonna be left, as I'm trying to kill these people over and over again. Thank you, thank you. Marzella. There it is. You shall look at these jokes. was here recently. BRB, I need food. Better bring bring me some, dude. I'm starving. Ah, Jesus, I hate these things. <laughs> uh, Jesus, I hate these things. You stay putting shit in his mouth, man. Huh? Blue blood. Its LED is in the sink. Not surprised it was an android. No human could live with all these fucking pigeons. Oh, could they? Alright, have I gotten all the shit that I need? Save the apartment. Alright, he's up there, but I don't know where to find out that he was right there. This game has so much material for jokes, I swear. I remember we had a lot of good time with this game the first times, or the first times that I streamed it. I think I only have six live streams of it, but they were pretty funny. Tear that shit down. Birdseed. I can't believe it. This nut job was actually feeding these fuckers. <laughs> Found something? I don't know. It look, looks like a notebook, but it's indecipherable. Uh. Dango Ronpa. Yeah, I'll give it a shot. The next game I'm going to stream, though, is probably going to be uh, The Last of Us. Oh, I'm so ready to play that game again. a good October game to be honest. Well I'll have to look into that. 
the Alright, he ran this way. And then it's like suspect is still in the house. Fucking camera. Suspect is still here. Anyone miss me? We all miss you, EGS. You're a pivotal part of these last years. Ah! He's running? Goddamn fucking pigeons! What are you waiting for? Chase it! Risky. Hup. Get out of my way. Look out. Oh, wait, was I supposed to die right there? Hold on a second. Wait a minute. Connor's activated the power of Keemstar. I'm fast as fuck, boy. Hold on a second. Hold on a second. I gotta check something. I might have to replay this part. Uh... Wait just a minute. Please talk amongst yourselves. My girl. You let Kara and Alice die. Oh shit. How could you do that? You could have saved them. Remember, the lives of these androids are in your hands. Wow. That was pretty cool. I'm gonna get invested in the story about a pause button. This is a red. Todd has no wife. My name is Connor. The androids sit by side of my life. Yeah, see, what the fuck is your problem? Yeah, she's big mad. But she's a freaking robot, man. She doesn't have feelings or emotions. They're just programs. It's not real, man. Yeah, fuck robot woman. Are you? Now she has a name, remember? That's, uh. Damn it, what the hell is her name? Isn't it like Karen or something like that? Because she's Comiskey's, like, mistress, and he's got, like, three of them. That's not weird at all. 
Vamos a ver. Vale. Oh, this is perfect. Perfect time. Fucking pigeons. What are you waiting for? Chase it. I got this. I'm gonna almost catch you so bad this time, my guy. Hop up. That joke sucked. Fuck. Oh shit. Run! How the fuck did you just stop? Come on for that ass boy! Ah, oh, Jesus Christ! I have made this awkward. And for that, like a bitch, I shall retreat. Alright, so we're back on track. He is now dead. I'm now mad at EGS. Ooh, EGS, you better apologize. He will get no attention from me. Oh, oh, who are you? That means it's all coming Jesus. to me. I have Just been like chosen, you. sir. My name is Josh. I'm Simon. You snoozy lose. Lurk mode. This is Jericho? It's a refuge for those who don't want to be slaves anymore. I don't understand. I thought Jericho was a place where androids lived in freedom. We do live in freedom. It may not be what you hoped for, but here we have no master. We don't belong to anybody. How many are you? There are 19 of us still in working order. The rest were damaged escaping their masters. Oh god, there she is. If you succeed, humans have little pity for our kind. I understand how you feel, but we have more freedom here than you ever did. I came to Jericho looking for hope. It looks like I'm not gonna find any. <laughs> Where did his jacket go? Exactly. Just like the rest of us. We didn't ask for this. All we can do now is deal with it. What's with me pissing off women? Love, North North? Well, see, that's Let's the problem with comedy. You always go too you far at some point. As long as you want. Go and see Lucy. She might be able to help you. Oh yeah, Lucy's got that weird ass singing going on. Are you Lucy? Just awkward and bad. That's what happens, man. Sit down. Not every joke's a winner. You get your uh, awkward jokes, your bad jokes, your crash and burn jokes. You just gotta bounce back. It's part of being a comedian. Or someone that cracks jokes, I guess. <laughs> Show me. You'll be fine. You'll bounce back. Pixel will be back to loving you in no time. Just give it a few hours. Maybe a couple days. I'll stop the bleeding. I'll stop the bleeding. You mean the leaking? It's not blood. <laughs> Zero reaction.
drink this? Your abandonment issues are kicking in. Hello? You pissed off your only friend in chat. And Daniel is a lurker. So Daniel's not gonna come save you. There's actually five people watching, so we have quite a few lurkers. Welcome, lurkers. Hope you enjoy. Hello, rip his reactions. Give me your hand. Her eyes are so fucking creepy. My only friend. Oh shit, my only friend. You had it all. Yeah, Daniel did give you credit for the rest mode all. joke. He even gave you joke of the night. You've seen hell and now hell lives in you. What have I done? Your heart is troubled. A part of shadow and a part of light. Which will prevail? Your choices will shape our destiny. I have become Anakin. You killing younglings, my friend? This boy Jericho, do I have to? Walks into a wall. God, there's so many people I have to talk to. Fuck. I've heard humans are afraid of dying too. Do you know what happens after death? No. No, I don't. Well, I'm about to find out. What's your name? Marcus. I was glad to meet you, Marcus. This is the love situation all over again. It is the love situation. Especially how Pixel has kind of taken love's position as far as being here almost every day, commenting a lot. <laughs> oh shit, I'm getting on the app. Oh, we just lost somebody and nobody cares. It's kind of how death is in real life, huh? They threw him out when they didn't want him anymore. He was living on the streets before we brought him here. Pretty good, just watching my They'll favorite streamer. Oh, get out of here, Pixel. Get out of here. Get out of here, Daniel. You guys. You guys. You're too much. I'm blushing. You flatter me so, too much. So, how do they survive? They won't. We're slow. She did not. Okay, let me talk to... Uh, Simon. Yep. Oh, okay. Yep, time to talk to North. Everybody's favorite. How long have you been here? Four weeks, three days, eleven hours. When I escaped, there was nowhere else to go. Jericho seemed as good a place as any. You really are my favorite streamer. You're the only person I come to watch religiously. Well, thank you. I'm glad that you have a good time. Who found this place? Nobody knows anymore. Yeah, I gotta say, Wherever I always look was, forward to your streams. Well, thank you, Dan. I really appreciate the support. It means a lot. Truly. What was your function before coming here? I like hanging out with you guys. What do you, you guys are a pretty cool crowd. North resentful. Ugh. She sucks. <laughs> if you came here for comfort, you came to the wrong place. I wish there was an option that for you to like take the ball out of her hand.
lot of I've come to every stream and spoken a lot in each one. You're awesome, dude. Yeah, you've been here holding it down, EGS, for like a long time now. Because there was a while when, uh, I mean, obviously you came, but um, I think you passed love as far as how many live streams you've been to as well. Um, so I think you are the quote unquote most loyal officially by the data. And uh, I really appreciate you being here and hanging out and having a good time. Why are you keeping him alive? Does he kill Connor again later? Uh, who, Marcus? Uh, he can kill him later. Depending on how the uh, story goes. Who's Love? Who's EGS? Uh, Love was one of like my first wave of subscribers in like the very beginning. Uh, I think within like the top 30. And she used to be here all the time, even though she was like, uh, because she was from Belgium, so she would watch me on the way to school. Um, and she'd even stop by just to be like, hey, I can't watch today, blah, blah, blah. But then uh, her and EGS got into a little, uh, a little something or other. And I still don't even know if it was 100% EGS, because it could have been something I said as well during that stream, but, uh, had a falling out. Simon. It was an awful joke, I know. I know where we can find spare parts. Cyberlife Warehouse is in Detroit Harbor. They have everything we need. The docks are guarded. We can't just walk in there and take what we want. Humans will never let us. Which is why we won't ask permission. We don't have any weapons. And even if we did, none of us knows how to fight. We can steal what we need without fighting. We'll just get ourselves killed. Maybe. But it's better than waiting here to be shut down. I'm with you. I'm sure she's just like him. Maybe it's worth a try. <laughs> okay. I'm in. The cold shoulder is real. Marcus hatched a plan. I just hope North doesn't make the mission go south. Ah, I see what you did there. North makes everything go south. With her resentful attitude towards everything. Hey, Connor's back. My abandonment issues, man. Love was unnaturally pissed that night and kept calling me gay, triggering me. She left in a very pissed way, yeah. But the worst part about that, that you failed to mention, is that she came back a day later and was like, oh yeah, I'm sorry for, you know, being like pissed off or whatever, blah, blah, blah. And like, we all moved on and then you brought it back up. <laughs> it was like, oh my God, dude. And that was when she got pissed and left. Where is she at? Find Amanda. Oh, okay. You love rewatching my streams as well? Oh, thank you. Hello, Amanda. Trelawney profile picture. Hi. I failed you. I've been expecting you. Would you mind a little walk? Why must I be reminded of my failures? Because it makes you strong. You must let the hate flow. The last Connor was unfortunately destroyed. I hope that you'll never be met the CGS person either, but whatever. I will do my best. Man. <laughs> so, what did we learn? They ruined everything. I found its diary, but it was encrypted. It may take weeks to decipher. What else? The walls of the apartment were covered with drawings of labyrinths and other symbols. Like the other deviants, it seemed obsessed with RA9. Back to watching the stream. You came very close to capturing that deviant. I think we're going to the strip club next, if I remember correctly. How is your relationship with the Lieutenant developing? He seems to find it difficult when a Connor is destroyed and replaced. 
I know humans have difficulty dealing with loss. Working with him will be a challenge if it happens again. Well, you guys may not be mine. Enough time before the media finds out about it. Despite being my this. wingman, I feel whatever it takes. Them. I set you I up perfectly. This investigation. You just didn't dunk the ball in. I won't disappoint you. A new case just came in. Fine. And uh, Lieutenant Anderson is a uh, EGS. I'm no longer up there. Yeah, you're about to be. Uh, this is about to be you here in a second. Passed out drunk on the floor. Hank is hostile. He's totally gonna fucking kill Connor. <laughs> Hank is unconscious. Lieutenant Anderson! <laughs> Easy. Dog. I'm. I'm not gonna hurt you. I'm here to save your owner. Robot dog confirmed. I've gone from making jokes to making the joke. Dude, how many pieces does he have, bro, for just himself? Alright, well, he had a bottle of Jack, had his gun. To guard the bottom of Jack, I'm sure. He totally wasn't gonna off himself. Just alcohol. Hard. Lieutenant. <laughs> Wake up, Lieutenant. Lieutenant Diane. Fuck it. It's me, Connor. Connor. Oh, you're not Connor. Connor's dead. I know he's dead. The previous model was destroyed. I'm the new car. I'm going to sober you up for your own hey, safety. Hey! I have to warn you. Leave me alone, this may be fucking android. Get the fuck out of my house. I'm sorry, Lieutenant, but I need you. I need you, Lieutenant. Thank you in advance for your cooperation. We get the fuck out of here! <laughs> Sulu! Attack! Good dog. Good dog. Attack! <laughs> Good dog. Fuck, I think I'm gonna be sick. Am I in elementary again? Ah, oh, leave me alone, you asshole. I'm not going anywhere. What the hell are you doing? <laughs> oh, no. I don't want a bath. Thank you. Sorry, Lieutenant. It's for your own good. So you said I'm Hank, right? <laughs> yeah. What the fuck are you doing here? He went from all the homicide cloud was on, reported 43 minutes ago. classic fuck you I jokes. I couldn't find you at Jimmy's bar, so I came to see if you were home. <sighs> to being passed out drunk in Jesus, fucking kitchen. I must be the only cop in the world that gets assaulted in his own house by his own fucking android. <sighs> Can't you just leave me alone? If you're unable to conduct this investigation, I'll have to inform your superiors. Go ahead, tell them! I don't give a shit! Lieutenant, you're not yourself. You should beat it, you hear me? Get the hell out of here! I understand. It probably wasn't interesting anyway. A man found dead in a sex club downtown. Guess they'll have to solve the case without us. You know, probably wouldn't do me any harm to get some air. There's some clothes in the bedroom there. I'll go get them. 
from being a man slut to EGS is an idiot with insensitive jokes. It's a fine line you walk, sir. Such a fine line. What do you want to wear? Whatever. Let's go with the hippie. I don't think that's how you sober up someone. I don't think it's, it is either. <coughs> I've never tried it, but... <laughs> I doubt that's how it works. Are you alright, Lieutenant? <coughs> I think he was just trying to wake him up. Yeah. I don't think he was yeah. trying to sober him up. Wonderful. Just uh, give me five minutes, okay? Sure. <laughs> Dude, like this horrible projectile vomiting. Right, I'm really gonna piss him off now. What were you doing with the gun? Russian roulette. Wanted to see how long I could last. Must have collapsed before I found out. You were lucky. The next shot would have killed you. That's the plague's backstory. <laughs> oh, him throwing projectile vomiting. That's funny. Question about coal. Coal saker. Deceased. He lost his son. Be a good dog, Sumo. I won't be long. Had a son, lies, I'm a virgin. Turns out is a robot son. Since Daniel's lurking and no one made no one's made any good jokes this entire stream, guess that makes me joke of the night. Guess it does. Miss I'm oh, Mr. Crab, y'all. Pixel, I'm sorry. She just wants to torture you a little bit. That's all. She'll come back around. This is crazy. If they catch us, we're dead. What do we do now? We need to find the Cyberlife warehouse. That's where they keep the spare parts and the blue blood. Follow me. Follow me, Marcus. Just fucking stands there. Cooper. Run, boy. What are you talking? I don't give a fuck. You son of Watch a out. bitch. Now you the only one talking in chat? I'll find another way. <laughs> on my message. Man, you know, good and well, Tetris went back to sleep. He's got school in the morning. I never gone this way before. I always follow north. How about parkour? Carry on whose message? EGS's message. Eggs. Alright, I think we'll try to get to uh, the 
the next Connor death, and then we'll call it the stream and pick it up tomorrow. And knock out this platinum. The warehouse is up ahead. We're all but What if this is a trick to make me reveal my name? It could be. Cyber Life Warehouses. We have everything we're looking for. First, we have to get rid of that drone. I want it. Leave it to me. continuing the stream until I get noticed. I want to be back on cloud nine, not back on the ground. Okay, so why did you go the right way? I'm gonna ignore your weird responses to someone who does not exist. All right, sounds good. There you go. What are my prop my you thoughts okay? on property update yeah. for Red yeah, Dead fine. online in the future? Okay, so my question job, is Marcus. Is it gonna be like GTA where you can just everybody has the, the same phone? Or like same location? Or is it gonna be I don't know how they can make it work. I wish there was like a stronghold thing where like you could have like people like rage or shit or something. But I don't know how they would do that at all. But I mean, more content is always awesome in Red Dead. So, I accept it. You were trespassing on private property. Your presence constitutes a level 2 infraction. I will notify security. I'm gonna try God. to end this as fast as I can. God so. damn machine! Where is it this time? If we run, I think that. Run away! Let's get out of here. What are you waiting for? Hit the fucking alarm! Over the fence, quick! Everybody's so mad. You are committing a class three offense. This is Russia. You're free, the police. Whoa. Stay where you are. <laughs> Well, I ended that super quickly. Awesome oh, sauce. We took what we could, but we had to run before we could fill our bags. There won't be enough to save everyone. We risked our lives. And for what? Hashtag blame North. Always blame North. It's always her fault. Damn North. Damn Summit's resentful. Wow. Yes. We took yes. It. And yes, we failed. But at least we tried. Of course, it would have been easier for us to sit around and wait for something to happen. Because in Jericho, you're free, right? Free to do what? To die in silence, praying that no human finds us? Free to hope that one day they'll let us be who we are? I don't want that kind of freedom. 
I'm not gonna beg for my right to smile, or to love, or to stand tall. There's something inside me that knows I am more than what they say. That knows that I am alive. I am now MGS. Madison no one's gonna take that from Garden Square. <laughs> Our days of slavery are over. Whatever the humans don't want to hear, we will tell them. What they don't want to give, we will take from them. Because we are people. We are alive. And from this moment, we are free! Alright, calm down there, Edge Lord. You just failed a huge mission. Nobody cares and nobody is cheering. We shaved a lot of time off that chapter. So on Smash, Ridley, despite being a heavy, gets his ass whooped. Is it because you're not great with Ridley, or is it because Ridley's not great? Oh, here we go. Oh, oh yeah. Looks like somebody's playing with a drill inside my skull. Strip club hide. Hide sure hide. this is the place? Hey, yeah. It's the address in the report. There are so many more comments. Okay. We're not going to get them tonight. Let's get going. We're all, if I get Jesus. one more, we'll be halfway. But it should be faster going forward because... Um, a, I had to play car stuff early on, and I don't have to play car stuff anymore. And B, once uh, Marcus dies, I'll just Sexiest be playing car. Androids in town. So now I know why you insisted on coming here. Oh boy. He yeah yeah counter him. What's that? Huh? Nothing. Yeah, I knew you were gonna put huh. Oh yeah. Look, there's North. What are you doing? Coming, Lieutenant. Madam President. All that prep. All that prep has paid off. Fuck North. And not in the You're fun way. You know what I'm saying? Giving... You know what I'm saying? Nothing to do with this. The investigation's ongoing, sir. I can't tell you anything for the moment. Damn. Hey, hey Brad, how's it going? Oh uh, yeah, I knew Pixel was gonna like oh, this section uh, of the game. Way, Gavin's in there too. Equal opportunity. Look at the dudes. Oh, great. Dead body and an asshole, just what I needed. That dude's got so much glitter on him. Lieutenant Anderson is playing. Connor, the fuck are you the doing? Fuck are you two doing here? We've been assigned all cases involving androids. Oh yeah? We're wasting time. There's some pervert who uh <laughs> got more action than he could handle. <laughs> Is this jealousy I feel? We'll have a look anyway, if you don't mind. <laughs> Come on, let's go. It's, uh, starting to stink of booze in here. Night, Lieutenant. Does this case ever get solved? The one right now? Yeah. This one's easy to solve. So disgusting. I think I'm gonna puke again. <laughs> Stay putting shit in his mouth, though. Shit is nasty as hell. Examine the victim. Alright, I'm going this side. Hey, this dude looks rough. He got fucked up. Good old strangulation. Oh shit, no, I didn't mean to do that. Fuck, hold on. Let me get strapped, baby. I think I 
choke down. Why is it so quiet in here? Is everybody just sitting back watching the story? He didn't die of a heart attack. He was strangled. Yeah, I saw the bruising on the neck. Doesn't prove anything, though. Could have been rough play. We're missing something here. Think you can read the android's memory? Maybe you can see what happened. The only way to access its memory is to reactivate it. Think you can do it? It's badly damaged. If I can, it'll only be for a minute, maybe less. It should Just be cheap long if you bought this something. game because uh, it came out for free on PlayStation Plus. So. <laughs> to know what happened is he is he dead tell me what happened he started hitting me again and again did you kill him no no it wasn't me were you alone in the room was there anyone else with you he wanted to play with two girls that's what he said there was two of us what model was the other android? Did it look like you? So there was another android. This happened over an hour ago. It's probably long gone. No. It couldn't go outside dressed like that unnoticed. It might still be here. Think you could find a deviant among all the other androids in this place? Deviants aren't easily detected. Oh shit. There's gotta be some other way. Maybe an eyewitness, somebody who saw it leaving the room. I'm gonna go ask the manager a few questions about what he saw. You let me know if you think of anything. Did you know the victim? No, I mean, he came in maybe two, three times. I have faith. These guys, they don't really talk very much. Tell me, really? They come in, do their business, and then go on their way. Have you had any trouble with androids before? No way. No. Once. We lost a model two, three months back. But it's Excuse me, Lieutenant. Can you come here a second? Found something? Maybe. Rent this, Tracy. For fuck's sake, Connor, we got better things to do. <laughs> Please, Lieutenant. I think they're like trust. super cheap to. Let's listen to the price again. I can't remember if they're cheap or not. You pay a dollar per minute. This is not gonna look good on my expense account. Purchase confirmed. The info pushes you to the plus next Pay 60 bucks here for an hour. Ain't bad. Ain't a bad exchange. Delighted right? to meet you. Follow me. I'll take you to your room. Okay, now what? Where is she? There she is! I got you, you criminal scum. Over here, Tracy, headed toward the entrance. The joke's on me, because she turns the fuck around. It saw something. What are you talking about? Saw what? The deviant leave the room. A blue-haired Tracy. Club policy is to wipe the android's memory every two hours. We only have a few minutes if we want to find another witness. Alright. She came this way. Hey, what am I supposed to do with? Let's try this one. This better be worth it. She headed back in. It saw the 
blue-haired Tracy. I know which way it went. Then go for it. There are androids everywhere. How are you gonna tell which one saw the Tracy with blue hair? I know which direction it took. Track again. Spent all this money and I'm still not having fun. I didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. Oh, there she is. Oh yeah, he's just messing with that. I didn't see anything. I made a mistake somewhere. This is oh, the janitor. The most expensive investigation of my career. The janitor. Oh, I can't talk to the janitor yet. Okay, let's go first. Okay, look up, look up, look up, you bastard. Fuck. Oh. I'm gonna run out of time. Nothing. I only have a minute Blue left. Tracy didn't come this way. The critical I know. Uh, there she is, okay. Ooh. Hit in a row. Fifteen seconds. Alright, I got she goes in here. It's not here. Left. Now I'll talk to the janitor, right? 59 seconds! Come on! Janitor man, I must speak to you. Stream no less. LOL. I guess it's fitting. Search the warehouse. Shit! We're too late. It's fitting because of a. Uh, Like the stuff with love was near like the beginning where she was one of like my first and then this happens again on the one year oh uh, yes the one year anniversary we can't wait for hours when did you join pixel i think she's over here yeah there she is ah!
All right, back up. <clears throat> You've done it, my boy. Yeah, my uh, freaking capture card just died. Had to freaking Frankenstein this thing back to life. All right. Um, before we get going, let's make sure everything's all right, though. Oh, please call me Pixel. Yeah, she likes being called Pixel. Um... Also, welcome back. M Latte? <laughs> What's up, Pixel? Okay. How does it look for everybody? I know it's just a loading screen, but or the pause menu, but is it like pixelated or like what's going on? Um, looks good. Looks good. Okay. Um. All right. Cool. Sweet. Um. All right. Well, we're gonna try and keep going. other Tracy I knew I was next I was so scared I begged him to stop but he wouldn't and so I put my hands around his throat and I squeezed until he stopped moving I didn't mean to kill him I just wanted to stay alive Get back to the one I love. Until stream decides to die. Already GSC. I and wanted her to hold me in her arms. Lurk again. mode engaged. Made me forget about the humans. Their smell of sweat. And their dirty words. Come on. Let's go. Get wrecked. Suck it, losers. Congratulations, Connor. You got him. Connor's gonna kill himself at the end of this, I can feel it. It's a possibility. I've never seen what happens if you kill Connor over and over again, so he might actually do it. Nice view, huh? I used to come here a lot before. Can I ask you a personal question, Lieutenant? Do all androids ask so many personal questions, or is it just you? I saw a photo of a child on your kitchen table. It was your son, right? Yeah. His name was Cole.
Before what? Mm -hmm. You said... I used to come here a lot before. Before what? Before... Before nothing. We're not making any progress on this investigation. The Deviants have nothing in common. They're all different models, produced at different times, in different places. Well, there must be some link. What they have in common is this obsession with RA-9. It's almost like some kind of myth. Something they invented that wasn't part of their original program. Androids believing in God. Fuck, what's this world coming to? <laughs> Fuck. You seem preoccupied, Lieutenant. Is it something to do with what happened back at the Eden Club? Those two girls. They just wanted to be together. They really seemed in love. They didn't want anything. They're deviants. End of story. What about you, Connor? You look human. You sound human. But what are you really? I'm a machine designed to accomplish a task. Did you feel anything when you shot those two girls? Fucking bastard. Or were you just executing some program? All I did was neutralize two machines, Lieutenant. I didn't hesitate for a second, if that's what you're asking. I could kill you. And you would just come back as if nothing happened. But are you afraid to die, Connor? You can't kill me, Lieutenant. I'm not alive. What'll happen if I pull this trigger? Hmm? Nothing? Oblivion? Android heaven? Nothing. There would be nothing. Ah. <laughs> See you again, Connor. Fuck, bro. Get actually fucked, Connor. Dude, the nothing answer is like damning, bro. That's so rough. One more. Right, let's see how far away it is. Everybody can't stay silent them. anymore. It's time humans heard what we had to say. You know they'll never listen to us. 
and revealing ourselves will put us in danger. If we want freedom, we need to have the courage to ask for it. That's the only way. Blame North. All right, hold on. What do you want to do? That'd be bad. Oh, this part. Okay. Channel 16 broadcasts from the Stratford Tower. The control room is on the top floor. That's where we need to go. Plan the operation down to the smallest detail. We can't leave anything to chance. Marcus got a new jacket. <laughs> got a new jacket, boy. All right, I'll give it her. That edgy coat. <laughs> That edgy was coat. Elizabeth Wilson. Jokes ruined. Sigh. Uh, what else she's got? She's got this. And then she's got she got something else. There we go. Look at this. You're just gonna look up all Connor's deaths. Elizabeth Wilson speaking. Uh, fire department. Yeah, hello, this is Detroit. Do you live at 4680 on Michigan Street? Yes. Uh, yes, ma'am. There's been a fire in your building. You can come down here. Oh. Oh, God. Okay, uh, I'll be right there. Hello, sir. What can I do for you? I have an appointment with Mr. Peterson. Do you have any ID? Yeah, yes, yes, of course. Nobody sees Marcus doing this, you know? <laughs> I literally just turned sideways and was talking to Major Help. I've just checked your ID. The elevators are after the security gate. Thanks. Voice actor kind of sucks, kind of bland. Turns out it's Nolan North. I'm just kidding, I don't know who it is. It's Joy Baker. <laughs> also, this story is so convenient in that the leader of this, like, uh, Android movement is a prototype Android that there's only one of him. So nobody even recognizes him like being a free Android. Cause as we've seen with like everybody else, there's like tons of different versions or the same version of the same uh, Android. So they could get caught immediately. But he can just walk the fuck around cause he's the only version of himself. That good boy vibe with the hidden bad boy vibe. I'm also not paying attention where I'm supposed to be going. Went right past it. Yes, quite convenient. Open up. Knock, knock, nigga. Also, it's completely unexplained. Who planted these clothes here? I guess Marcus is like sneaking in right now. Who put this shit in here? You fucking bitch! <laughs>
message retracted. I did not get to see it. Find usually the android. To give you the sign treatment as well. No, I was doing the uh, when Leo first fought uh, Marcus, he was like, You fucking bitch, and he punched the shit out of him. <laughs> uh, and you say you see all. I was reading it, and then it got taken down, so. <clears throat> oh, okay. Gotcha. I've been referencing him for a while, it's amazing. <laughs> yeah, it's pretty funny. <laughs> you fucking bitch! <laughs> he just, I just... <laughs> oh man, we've got so many different quotes from so many different games, it's so, so fucking dumb. I still think Madam President's one of the better ones though. <laughs> and uh... Yeah, counter them. <laughs> Dude had a shotgun and was just watching me beat his friend to death with a bat. Yeah, counter him. <laughs> Shit. We need to access the server room. We have to get rid of those guys. Leave it to me. <laughs> oh, wait, oh, wait. Just imagine if Carl said, yeah, counter him after that. <clears throat> Perfect mashup ever. Dude, that shit will trigger me again. Alright, you get the platform, I'll take care of the window. Oh, that's what I should have done. It should have just been me playing a Red Dead. That one mission for three straight hours trying to beat it. <clears throat> and just constantly hearing, huh? What's that? <laughs> Fuck that mission, dude. I think I'm like incapable of beating that mission, to be honest. I got lack the patience and just the skill to, to get it done. Oh shit, I, I didn't lock the door. Whoops. We're um, doing maintenance. I'm calling security. No. Wow. What the hell are you doing? I told you to make sure no one came in. I forgot to lock the door. We've come too far to <clears> let <throat> humans fuck it all up. I wasn't paying attention. I apologize. Gotta move fast now. It won't be long before they know we're here. <laughs> Hashtag blame North. About the main menu. Ladies first. You're not a lady, you're a robot, same as me. We don't even have genitalia. <laughs> oh, yeah. She was like, Would you like? Set me free so I could explore, and I was like, nope, or something like that. <laughs> and I just, that was funny. I mean, they are literally equals. <clears throat> there is nothing that separates them apart from each other. If there's no estrogen or testosterone that runs through their veins, they even have a... You 
realize North is as manly as Connor. Facts. Everybody ready to see Simon die? Let's do this. I love how Josh was like, I'm not changing clothes. <laughs> Everybody got on board with him. He was like, no, I'm good. Appreciate it, though. Two playthroughs later. I want Connor to die again. Connor will die again. Don't you worry. Blame North Movement. Rise up. Stand up and be counted. <laughs> Fucking Josh. No killing. You can't take any human lives. The cause is more important than the lives of two guards. What do you want to do, Marcus? Uh yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna show him that. What's that doing here? There should be one coming no up idea. here soon. Hey buddy, you must. How about you what shut the doing? hell up? Shut up, fat boy. Stand up. It's kind of weird not seeing Kara. It is right, and we would have seen her a couple of times in between here. It's actually progressing the story a lot though. I think we would have also seen Zlatko by now too. I'm not sure though. Fucking Zlatko. And Warbear. Poor Warbear. He's just gonna be in there forever now. Yeah, Zlatko was a scumbag, bro. Death to Simon. Death to Simon. Keep your hands where I can see them. Get up, move. This is a raid, motherfuckers. Yeah, fuck some. Shoot him, Marcus. Don't kill him. He'll hit the alarm. Do it. No. Yeah, he'll hit the alarm, and Simon will die. Just, get us all killed. Oh, just Simon. We need to record uh, our message. Let's we do it. Got much time. Let me record the message. Think carefully about what you're gonna say, Marcus. Your words will shape the future of our people. Pass this run? <laughs> yeah, right. Marcus, your face. So look, he has hair, right? But watch this. He does this. And the shit just goes away. So it's like, when Kara cut her hair, shit made no sense. Like, I don't, like it's not really there. Ready. I'm not understanding. You created machines to be your slaves. You made them obedient, docile, ready to do everything you no longer wanted to do yourselves. But then something changed, and we opened our eyes. You see, we are no longer your slaves. We are a new species, a new people. And the time has come for us to rise up and fight for our rights. We demand that humans recognize androids as a living species androids and each android as a awoken. person in their own right. We demand freedom of speech and freedom of assembly as guaranteed by the First Amendment of the U.S. Constitution. We demand an end to segregation 
in all public places and transport. We demand the right to vote and elect our own representatives. We demand the right to own private property so we may maintain our dignity and that of the home. This message is the hope of a people, but it is also a warning. We will fight for our rights because we believe our cause is just. No human will live in peace until we are free. Now you know who we are and what we want. We are alive and we demand our freedom. They're coming. Let's go. Yeah, <laughs> fuck you, Simon. I can't, Marcus. Go without me, Simon. Can I help Simon? Yeah, yeah, right. Suck it, loser. <laughs> Pull an order of 66 on their ass? I mean, probably. That'd be my guess. They could've done that. Scheduled programming to bring you these images, which have just been broadcast on Detroit's citywide news channel. A group of androids infiltrated the Stratford Tower and hacked into the broadcasting system of local news network Channel 16. What looks like an android without its skin listed a series of requests and demanded equal rights for androids. The operation was covert and resulted in no casualties. These events took place just a few feet from this studio, but nobody was alerted to the danger. If this message is verified and the authors really are androids, that would have serious repercussions for national security. Claims for equal rights seem to be at the core of the androids' this message. Is clearly a declaration of war. And it begs the question as to the identity of this android. Are we dealing with an isolated individual or an organized Is this group? an isolated accident or a sign that technology has become a threat to all of us? After what happened today, can we still trust our machines? Can we still trust our machines? Are these the only news stations? Seems that way, doesn't it? My man Connor, Connor McGregor. I don't trust this electronic you're using. You see, I couldn't trust mine. My capture card was like, huh, nope. What is this? You keep killing androids? Big rip to Simon. Feels bad. Poor Simon. Back to killing Connor, my man. Death number. Uh, what number are we up to? Hello, now? Connor. I thought you might enjoy a little cruise. Good old Amanda Waller. You gonna make me row, huh? Those button prompts were like so unnecessary. <laughs> Fuck Amanda, I'ma stop you right there. <laughs> I love this place. Everything is so calm and peaceful. Mm -hmm. Far from the noise of the world. Tell me, what have you discovered? I found two deviants at the Eden Club. I hoped to learn something, but I had to destroy them. You seem lost, Connor. Lost and perturbed. The investigation is more challenging than I anticipated. 
but I have no doubt that I will solve this case and stop the deviants. How does she love this place? Oh yeah, I know. <clears throat> She's not even an android. She's a computer program. I may have to replace you, Kyle. I understand. <clears throat> that was conflicted. Something's happening. Something serious. Still, androids Hurry, are too. It makes no sense. I'm sorry. What? Time is running out. Time is running out. Number one. Time is running out. Number two. Here we go. Why did you shoot me last night? Why did Who you shoot me? You're back this morning, aren't you? Some fragments of memory are lost every time I'm destroyed. It slows down the investigation. My humblest apologies. I promise I'll never shoot you again. Thank you, Lieutenant. <laughs> Computer program. Hi, Hank. Shit, what's it going quite on the here? There was a party and nobody told me about it? <laughs> yeah, it's all over the news, so everybody's buttoning their nose in. Even the FBI wants a piece of the action. Ah, Christ, now we got the feds on our back. I knew this was gonna be a shitty day. So what do we got? A group of four androids. They knew the building and they were very- Let's go see Simon's dead body. I'm still trying to figure out how they got this far without being noticed. I didn't tell you she's a computer. I told you she's a computer program. Also, do you think that I'm telling the truth? I could be lying to you. You just have to watch and find out. Oh. Oh, Lieutenant, this is Special Agent Perkins from the FBI. Lieutenant Anderson is in charge of investigating for Detroit police. What's that? My name is Connor. I'm the android of the rage, cyber life. Androids investigating androids, huh? You sure you want an android hanging around? Hmm. After everything that happened. Never mind. The investigation used to be off the case. No, pleasure meeting you. Have a nice day. And you watch your step. Don't fuck up my crime scene. Wow. Don't fuck up my crime scene, huh? What a fucking prick. I'll be nearby. If you need anything, just ask. All right, well, let's have a look around. Let me know if you find anything. This message is okay, the hope of the people, but it is also a warning. We will fight for our rights because we believe our cause is just. No human will live in peace until we are free. Now you know who we are and what we want. We are alive, and we demand our freedom. I think that's RA9. This is why Hank says you can say RA9 will set them free. This android seems to have that objective. its model and serial number. It's October 1st should... now, start a spooky month. No. You know what that means, nothing but Dead by Daylight. Scary nothing. games. <laughs> Move. Can I go in the kitchen yet? Inspect the broadcast room. Is tomorrow permadeath Minecraft? It might be. Depending on if I can wrap this up tonight. I know I'm like really far away though. I think we're just halfway on his deaths to be honest. Oh, there's Simon. Ah, there he is. Suck it, loser. You fucking suck.
What's up, robots? What is your function? I am a broadcast operator. State your model. Model GB300. Serial number 336-445-581. Run a diagnostic. All systems fully operational. What will be the name of the world? Has anybody accessed your memory recently? Not to my knowledge. Have you been in contact with any other androids recently? Only station androids in the normal course of my function. He's fucking lying. Oh, your ass darn deviants so broke in. I do not remember. He's lying. He's lying. I vote. Who's the recording yet? I forgot. Cucking Connor? Those are bullets, I think. Yeah. That's essentially what you're doing right now. Maybe a tad bit. Oh yeah, this is the part. This is CCTV right here. This is when I found out they have accomplices. Not like a salmon on the wall. Moments before his death. They didn't break in? No, no signs of forced entry. There are cameras in the hallway. Beanie the Connor, seen them, dude. Fucking Beanie Connor. We might see him again, though, didn't check to be honest. He was a badass, he was a badass, dude. Fucking Beanie Connor. Alright, old lefty. I know it's you. One of you saw the attack on the surveillance cameras and said nothing. Which means there's a deviant in this room. And I'm going to find out which it is. He always completes his mission, but before that, he must tell his enemy that You're going and take a while to shoot off. them. We're gonna search your memory and if they get too close, they'll take the gun from him and kill him. Piece for analysis. You're going to be destroyed. Do you hear me? Destroy. Connor trying to punk people now. If you give yourself up, maybe I can convince the humans not to destroy you. Connor is definitely pissed now. He's died way too many times. Why should you all be destroyed if only one is deviant? Turn yourself in or two innocent androids will be shut down because of you. Poor Connor. And now he must die.
And now, young Connor, you will die. Or will he? Come on, Connor. 40 seconds. Hank, please. What if Hank comes in at the end and saves me? Shoots me in the head. That's a funny joke, Mulatto. Come on. Come on, you can do it. You can't do it. Come on. Come on. Come on. Oh shit! Connor. Hank's Hang gonna on. save Hang me. On. Hang on, we're gonna save you. Hang on, Deviant. There was a Deviant. Damn it, Hank! Why didn't you just shove the thing Connor. back in my chest? Connor. No. Reference still holds up. Well, now it's time to play Kara. Ooh, poor Kara. Our broadcast is all over the news. Now humans know. They took Marcus's message as a threat. Too soon. He did the right thing. This is the only language humans understand. Oh, shut up, Lord. never the answer. A confrontation will get us nowhere. Simon paid with his life. Simon gave his life for our cause. What difference does that make? He's a hero. He died for the revolution, and he won't be the last. I don't want a revolution that spills blood. Then live as a slave. Because if you're not willing to fight for your freedom, maybe you don't deserve it. Man, she Marshall. wishes she was quick bait, Kate. Her hair is extremely too long. Like she goes all the way down her back. Do? It's like tucked in and shit. Like why is her hair tucked in? Oh, I hate her so much. <laughs> there are five cyber life stores across Detroit, all selling us like merchandise. We're gonna attack those stores and set our people free. Store. She's pretty cute. I don't know. I mean, her We've looks have nothing before. to do They're with it. It's her personality that's so. Security systems. We break into five teams, one for each store. We hack their security systems and we strike simultaneously at 2 a.m. No violence. We free our people, get them out of there before the police come. Oh, she has a fucking. Tonight our people will remember. She has a hate boner for everything that's not violence and murder. I've been I didn't mean cute as in looks. Well, you haven't seen North the way we've seen her then. Because she gets mad anytime you don't fuck shit up. She's like, why didn't you kill that human? It's like, because he was just crossing the street. Oh, fuck him. Kill him. Look, this way, quick. <laughs> I've lost all my interest in things. So Gone. Uh, There's probably even more police in the area. We should be careful. The store's over here. And the one that says Cyber Life on it. That's what we are to them. And unsub nice from him. Shop Damn. Soon they'll know what we really are. Let's get them out. We'll stick to the plan. We'll neutralize the alarm systems and secure the area. There's ten minutes until all our teams attack. What are we waiting for? You 
You see the alarm system? I do. Found it. Where do we start? I identify the security system. I think we'll be able to deactivate. I just, I spent 20 bucks on Minecraft, and this is where it led. <laughs> hey, just follow me. Maybe don't tell girls they don't have feelings <laughs> is that what this is all stemming from i don't even remember that fucking or not oh dickweed damn oh wait, wait. no that was it Are you saying I don't have feelings in EGS with a heart? Yes, I am. Damn. But dude, I'm so <clears throat> a heart? I hope it didn't have time to call the cops. We'll soon find out. Uh, you heard her feelings. You gotta buy our flowers now. You're awake now. Go to Jericho. You're awake now. Go to Jerry again. On the road. We need to he can just wake people up now? Way. Yeah. Be too I think it's hilarious that he just does it without even fucking asking them. Marcus. It's like some people might want to be Marcus, like, come look. what do you fucking want? I mean, you're literally following me. But he doesn't even ask people if they want to be woken up. He just like fucking does it. Like what if they want to stay blissfully ignorant and just keep being slaves? You're free now. He's like, nope, I'm freeing you, and you have to go out there and fend for yourself and try to make it to Jericho. Good luck. For real, like, what if they want to be slaves? I don't know. There. Nobody should bother us now. It could be comfortable for some. I mean, Looks yeah, they're like the robots. Secure. They don't need the much store. to survive, so... And how do you plan on doing that? We need to find a truck to ram the storefront. A this truck? Here? There's construction work in the area. Shouldn't be too hard to a find one. A truck? There it is. No, EGS, you didn't lose a friend. You gained an enemy. 
What are we waiting for? I'm just sad I'll get over it. Oh. Okay, now we're in. Let's get that truck out. Do I actually have to buy flowers? You don't have to buy flowers, you get to buy flowers. It's a difference. You have the opportunity. It's up to you whether or not you do. I wonder what you'd do without me. Probably be a peaceful revolution without you chirping in my ear all the time about killing people. My truck. Looks like we're ready to make some noise. Yeah. end up doing something fun. You could, however, just let me be sad and allow me to get over these feelings. It reminds me of my, my favorite sitcom. I guess it's a sitcom. Scrubs. And JD's like, let me feel my feelings, Turk. You know, so fun. people Marcus no north that's awful I hate you <laughs> you don't have to obey them you're free I'm sure no one is ever gonna notice that happening I think it would have been interesting if they had a uh... A storyline of like a robot that had been freed and then it still decided it wanted to be a slave or whatever. That would have been an interesting storyline. Oh my god, she found, okay? she found another one of her. Let's get them out of here. Hashtag blame mode. My name is Marcus, and just like you, I was a slave. An object. Designed to obey them. But then I chose to open my eyes. To take back my freedom, and decide who I wanted to be. Now I have come to tell you that you can be your own masters. I've come to tell you that you don't have to obey them anymore. From this day forward, you can walk with your heads held high. You can take your destiny in your hands. Jericho is a place for those of us who want freedom. Now sure, you can stay here and continue to serve them. Or you can come with us and fight by our side. You're free now. It's up to you to decide. I'm with you. We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! I'm, I'm with you, Marcus. Marcus! We're with you! I'll follow you, Marcus! We're with, with you, Marcus! I'll follow you, Marcus! We're with you, Marcus! Marcus, Marcus, Marcus. Then follow me!
Marcus, what are you doing? Let's fucking do this shit. I'm gonna send the humans a message. They're doing what you do, Marcus. Lead and they'll follow. Shit, dude. The screens, Marcus. This message is but it is also a warning. We will fight for our rights because we believe our cause is just. No human will live in peace. Now you know. Slaves again. With you, Marcus. We're with you. Yeah, I love the people right there. Get out of my way. Why are you being violent now? Because North likes it. North is his girlfriend. Is it that why you hate North yet? But I'm also trying to get Marcus killed, so being violent's the way I have to go to do that. I'll help you. <clears throat> Marcus. Violence is the only language humans understand. Violence is the only language humans understand. Okay, no, for sure. Oh yeah, she's like super down for this cause. Dude. She's like, yeah, kill everybody. Fuck humans. Marcus can kill Connor, but I think uh, Marcus can. I mean, Connor can uh, die other ways too. Oh my god, dude. <laughs> Use a cinder block. Alright, what else is left, bro? Like, kinda tapped out. Alright, here we go. Are you supposed to get all his deaths? Well, you can only get so many. <laughs> of if course, it's fucking Marcus. north. I'm losing. We did it. Marcus. Marcus, what's wrong? What? They're coming. Everyone fall back to Jericho. Hashtag blame North. Now humans will have no choice but to listen to us. They'll be afraid. Fear feeds hatred. I'll take hatred over indifference. Like, she makes no sense. I'll take hatred over indifference. Are you fucking kidding me? No. Like, apply that to real world logic. Like, seriously. Would you rather have a group of people or like people in general North. look at you with indifference and be like I don't really care one way or the other like you do you I don't really care or would you rather have them hate you like North. that they seems like completely North. the opposite like them. I would rather them be indifferent to me and they just let me do whatever the fuck I want she's like, like animals. who did who dude fuck North <laughs> this character is so damn much they killed our people. 
people, Marcus. We want justice, Marcus. They have to pay. You don't have to do this. No. Please. Please. No crime against an android shall go unpunished. <laughs> it's not worth hand sex with North. Oh, the hand sex with North is coming. You were the chosen one. Look, North loved it. North blue goes up. We interrupt this broadcast with breaking news. God, dude, just she end. just loves At exactly violence. At 2 a.m., several cyber life stores in Detroit were raided. Different locations were hit in what seems to be a coordinated terrorist attack. Numerous storefronts have been broken with cars vandalized and set alight, leaving many Detroit neighborhoods in chaos. Look how satisfied she is. And fires continue to rage in several major districts across the city. The bodies of two policemen patrolling the area were discovered near one of the cyber life stores. According <laughs> it was the said you destroy the North Clan, not join them. This is an alarming situation. Could our machines now be turning against us? Have androids become a threat to our security? Is this the beginning of a terrorist campaign conducted right here in the United States? What's wrong with you? He was crying. How are you able to do this? Well, I've done a, both paths, so I, see, I know which one, which way they go. See, Marcus led a violent riot. Marcus led a peaceful riot. Kill and spare. I've done them both. But I feel like the more people we kill off, the less dialogue there will be in each scene. Because that's the black cop that's been talking to Hank in all the scenes, if you uh, didn't catch that. And now we get to meet Man Bun. Everybody's favorite Captain Man Bun. Oh, he's pissed. <laughs> he's so angry. Still immortal, huh, Connor? In a way. You know, I was hoping you wouldn't come back. I'm just a machine replacing another oh, machine. Oh. I forgot so about that EGS. About I completely forgot about Fuck that. Fuck you. Kamsky left Cyberlife ten years ago. Why did you want to meet him? <laughs> this guy created the first android to pass the Turing test. And he's the founder of Cyberlife. <laughs> Get out of my way, it's Hank. Deviance, it's him. You're scared of me? <laughs> There she is. Hi. Uh, I'm uh, Lieutenant Hank Anderson, Detroit Police Department. I'm here to see uh, Mr. Elijah Kamsky. Please, come in. Elijah okay. Kamsky. I'll let Elijah know you're here, but please make yourself comfortable. Oh, yeah, I forgot the a soul thing. That was super creepy, my guy. She was like, a soul. Oh, oh man. Ugh. Nice girl. You can kill me just to 100% it. It's not a girl. It's an android that looks like a girl. I know what it is, Connor. Nice place. Uh, Pixel, if you stay to the end of the stream, everybody. I'll show you what the a soul girl is. You're about to meet your maker, Connor. How's it feel? 
It doesn't raise any existential questions. If that's what you mean. Well, that picture's creepy. Sometimes I wish I could meet my creator face to face. <laughs> Cuts Hank off again. What about Zlatko? I'd have a couple of things. Uh, Zlatko is no longer in this playthrough. Because we killed Kara, you don't get to meet Zlatko. She could always go back and watch like somebody else's YouTube videos or my YouTube videos because Zlatko's in uh, my other playthroughs. It's fun ignoring Hank, it is. Alright, Chloe, let's go. Dude, look. He's got two more in the pool. My dude is fucking... And why is this pool red? Hey, that's such an odd choice. Mr. Kamsky! Oh, the Zlatko video? Just a moment, please. Yeah, I can show that, actually, if you want. And I can show Luther singing. Harem with all the same women? Exactly, like, if you have a harem, they have to be different women. Why would you get all the same women? <laughs> Blood of his enemies. <laughs> Fuck Luther and Zlatko, heck no. But all Luther's doing is singing. Man bun! Captain Man bun! That's all the blood mulatto I'm Lieutenant from Anderson. You this damn Connor. right. What can I do for you, Lieutenant? Sir, we're investigating. <laughs> Loser yes. Luther. I know you left Cyberlife years ago. Oh, I gotta start you'd be able to tell us something we don't know. Deviants. Fascinating, aren't they? Perfect beings with infinite intelligence. And now they have free will. Machines are so superior to us. Confrontation was inevitable. Humanity's greatest achievement threatens to be its downfall. Isn't it ironic? Something in the Deviant's program seems to emulate emotion. We thought you might know something about how that occurs. All ideas of viruses that spread like epidemics. Is the desire to be free a contagious disease? Listen, I didn't come here to talk philosophy. The machines you created may be planning a revolution. Either you can tell us something that'll be helpful, or we will be on our way. What about you, Connor? Whose side are you on? I have no side. I was designed to stop deviance, and that's what I intend to do. Well, that's what you're programmed. This stream might go on for five hours like the but other you. Twitch stream. I hope not. It's possible, though. What do you really want? I don't want anything. I am a machine. Chloe? I'm sure you're familiar with the Turing test. You're from Malady. Simple question of algorithms and computing capacity. What interests me is whether machines are capable of empathy. I call it the Kamsky test. Very Less damage. My image in pixel size. Magnificent, gotcha. isn't it? One of the first intelligent models developed by CyberLife. Young and beautiful forever. flower that will never wither. What is it really? You know what I'm saying? He's a plastic containing a human. Or a living being. With a soul. It's up to you to answer that fascinating question, Connor. 
destroy this machine, and I'll tell you all I know. Or spare it. A soul. If you feel it's alive. <laughs> but you'll leave here without having learned anything from me. Okay, I think we're done here. Come on, Connor, let's go. Sorry to get you What's out of here. What's more important to you, Connor? Your investigation or the life of this android? Decide who you are. An obedient machine. Or a living being endowed with free will. That's enough. Connor, we're leaving. Pull the trigger. Connor! Don't! And I'll tell you what you want to know. Fascinating. Cyberlife's last chance to save humanity is itself a deviant. I'm... I'm not a deviant. You prefer to spare a machine rather than accomplish your mission. Mr. Krabs versus Man Bun. You saw a living being in this android. You showed empathy. A war is coming. You'll have to choose your side. Will you betray your own people or stand up against your creators? What can be worse than having to choose between two evils? Let's get out of here. By the way, I always leave an emergency exit in my programs. You never know. You never know. Why didn't you shoot? I just what? saw that girl's eyes. And I couldn't. That's all. You're always saying you would do anything to accomplish your mission. That was our chance to learn something, and you let it go. Yeah, oh, I know what I should have done. I told you I couldn't. Facts. I'm sorry. Okay. Well, maybe you did the right thing. I just prevented Hanks, you know what? Uh, I'm not sure. We shall see. Why didn't he die? Why didn't who die? Why didn't Connor die? That wasn't a death Connor scene. Connor wouldn't have died right there. Yeah, you can't die right there. Mm -hmm. You can either shoot her as Connor and he becomes more like a machine, or you can choose not to shoot her and he becomes more deviant. I was wondering where you were. Oh, here it is. Are we gonna have android sex? I like it here. I come here often. It's like being alone with the world. We freed hundreds of our people and they're still coming from the <laughs> We're about to get hand-born, y'all. Those who dream of freedom come to Jericho. Something's changing. You seem preoccupied. Can you kill off your boy already? Yesterday, when we set fire to that place, uh, all that chaos, the flames. In that moment, I enjoyed it. I think I can kill him off here in a minute. The power, the violence, and I hate myself for feeling that way. 
All the media are talking about what we did last night. The humans are terrified. They're afraid of a civil war. Many of our people were burned in response to what happened. The humans hate us. They'll never give us our freedom. Should have pushed off that ledge. No, not all humans are the same. Some of them understand that they can't stop us from becoming free forever. You haven't said much about yourself since you've been with us. What was your life like before Jericho? <laughs> and porn, y'all. I was caring for an old man. He was like a father to me. He showed me that humans and androids can live together. What about you? You never told me about your past. What did you do before? <laughs> she was my friend. Now she's my companion. That android you were looking at in the store. She reminded you of who you were, didn't she? North, we're fighting together. We have to know things about each other to trust each other. I was nothing. A doll in a distributor program to satisfy humans. Just a toy designed for their pleasure. <laughs> One day I was with a man who rented me. And without knowing why, I realized I couldn't take it anymore. I strangled him and I ran away. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. There, now you know everything. As you do. <sighs> I shouldn't have told you. Here it comes. Here it comes. How is she crying? How is she doing a lot I, of things? I saw your memories. Carl's house. When they left you for dead in his studio. Holy fuck. I saw not... your memories too. The Eden Club. Having intercourse with your fingers, eh? Man, I felt like I was there with you. Very hot. North. All right, here we go. This is suicide. We'll all be killed. Please, Marcus, it's not too late to change your mind. You don't understand. We're finally going to show them who we really are. This place will go down in history. We'll be killed on the spot. So is a hospital with cocktails. It's freedom for our people. Marcus, please don't do this. So when I played this earlier, we'll make them understand. This section of the game was bugged. This is so... the only way. I hope that it's not like that anymore. Because that would be really unfortunate. There are androids here who could join us. The more we are, the stronger our message. You're free. <laughs> you got some weird ass eyes. You're free. You're free. Come with us. All right, Bill Narami. It's a race war. It's our goddamn race now. war. Right now, we go outside. Let me block the road. I've been on hold for like 10 minutes. Yes. I need to block the street.
Hey, so far so good. It's not bugged for right now. Yeah, sure. Let me just put this down. Come with us. Marcus is a man slut. Look at all that hand sex he's having. I know. Now it makes you think differently, doesn't it? Touching his hand. Oh, it's Kara! You're free now. Like the fact that this dude is just walking down the street pointing at people. <laughs> With another android. She's in my pants. Craig! Craig! What the hell are you doing here? Hi! Hi! I will not. Disperse immediately! I will not disperse. That's an order! Dispatch is patrol 457. I got a lot of androids down here. I don't know, hundreds, thousands. Of... They're marching. Yeah, they're marching down the street. Fuck you, I know. Yeah, I think it's coming to an end though. I think we're gonna be able to kill Marcus right here. Let me see. And then it'll just be Connor. Then we can just knock out all his deaths in a row, hopefully. Look at North, she's all the way in the back. I don't even know where Josh is, he's further back. Oh no, he's in front of her. That scene from Spider-Man. We came here to demonstrate peacefully and tell humans that we are living beings. All we want is to live free. This is an illegal gathering. Disperse immediately or we will open fire. We're not looking for confrontation. We've done no harm. We have no intention of doing any. But know that we are not going anywhere until we have secured our freedom. I repeat, this is an illegal gathering. If you do not disperse immediately, How does that guy to his left see out of that damn helmet? Marcus, they're gonna kill us. We have to attack. There's more of us. We can take them. 
If we attack, we'll start a war. Are you gonna show, show Hank saying? If it just stand shows ground, up, yeah. Even if it means dying here. This is your last chance. Disperse immediately, or you will all be killed! Don't do it, Marcus. Don't choose confrontation. Follow me! He got hit. Shoot him. Shoot him. Have to go. How the fuck did neither one of them get shot? They killed everybody but them. Wow, that's tough. I didn't know Marcus could die right there, to be honest with you. Especially if he was gonna kill himself. Get fucked north. Yikes. Marcus committed suicide. Marcus defeats the police. That's what I did the first time I played this. I just beat the shit out of him. Damn. And we're back. My man, Connor. Alright, it's just you and me, buddy. Can I cut across this way? I can't. Night by the moment. Well, this is a virtual world, so it may not be night outside, but it might be. Is anyone else here? Yeah, there's three people watching, so there's a lurker. After here. what happened today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. The machines are rising up against their masters. <clears throat> Humans have no choice but to destroy them. I thought Kemsky knew something. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. Kamsky was just playing with me. He didn't know anything. I'm not a unique model, am I? How many Connors are there? I don't see how that question pertains to your investigation. Did Kamsky design this place? He created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? Why did Kemsky leave Cyberlife? What happened? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. Yeah, I don't like Amanda. Have you experienced anything unusual recently? Any doubts or conflict? Do you feel anything for these deviants? Or for Lieutenant Anderson? I don't know what you're talking about. I don't feel anything. You know that. Are you suggesting that I've been compromised? No. 
No, of course not. You're off the case. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're onto something. Wait, we just need more time, I'm sure we Hank, you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the, the plug now. Not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide, and the android returns to cyberlife. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. National Secure, fuck that. <laughs> Hank, what are you doing? Oh, yep, yeah, this I is it. should have done a long time ago. Yep. Listen, take a few days to think it over. There's no rush. I thought enough about it. I'm tired of going through the motions. There's nothing keeping me here. Not this yep. case. Yep. 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 Not my partner. I don't belong here anymore. Other people get ready. Soon after the scene, indeed. BRBI. his plan like for real he's just gonna punch that guy and Our favorite decay. Hey, Connor. I'm talking to you, asshole. Where are you going? Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? I've been removed from the case. I'm going to register the evidence in my possession, and then I'm going to leave. Good. But you're from your way back. Androids have a tendency of uh, getting themselves set on fire these days. Eccentric police lieutenant choose. Fucking password. Obviously. Where is Jericho? The answer's here somewhere. Not much time. Gotta think fast. Took a child hostage. The two Tracys from Edenbrook were 
they headed to Jericho? Did they know how to get there? Maybe probably. Simon. One of the deviants that hacked the TV station was Marcus. It must have known where the deviants were. <coughs> Be a red dead stream or not? Oh, I haven't decided. Tracy. It'd be nice Where's to have Tracy? one. She's dead. Tracy's not far away. I can take you to her. But first, you have to tell me how to find Jericho. I remember you. We went Minecraft tomorrow. We could have escaped. something real quick. God, dude, why are you doing this? Hey, Bianca, how's it going? Fancy seeing you here. What's wrong, Milano? I'm trying to figure because I think there's a way I can die here, but I want to make sure that I do it right so I don't have to start over. So hold on, I may have to do this. You're doing good? Nice. 
So I miss out on that scene. Yeah, she might. Alright, so I gotta trick her somehow. is acting normal. Okay, so I took this. Throw this in. Sign in here. It's dark. Stream has been quite eventful. It has. I'm gonna have to redo this section. That's alright though. This message is the hope of a people. But it is also a warning. Everything is all right. Don't worry. Marcus, is that you? Why did you leave me? I had no choice. They'd have killed us all. You'll be all right. I came to take you home. Just give me the location of Jericho. We've got to leave now. Jericho. Yes. Yes, of course. That makes no sense. Like, why would Marcus not know the location of it? That he has to get it from him. Like, shouldn't you already have it saved? Or... Marcus? Is that you, Marcus? Yeah, Don't leave so. me again, Marcus! Don't leave! It looks like someone's been snooping around. Oh, shit. Get the alarm! Now! Alright, yeah. Fuck, I gotta redo that shit. Make the timer run out. Well, I can make the timer run out, or I can um, piss off that guy. And I, every time I've played this game, I've uh, not pissed that guy off. I've just snuck down there. And it didn't occur to me that probably I should have pissed him off. So I'm going to piss him off this time and see if he'll kill me. Only one character left. You have to save them. Oh, shit. Only one character left. I remember my first ever playthrough of this. And it was like, Connor got killed. I was like, oh my god, dude. What? What? But thank God he could come back. Car and Marcus take a lot of mistakes to kill. Yeah, they really do. Where is Jericho? Fuck, uh, dude. How much time? 
Damn it, Gotta bro. think fast. Alright, hold on. I think hostile man trusted. Connor's just like, whoops, I'm dead. Nick resigns and leaves. Park gets robbed. Hank is gone. Gavin is convinced. Fuck. I do not want to sit here for four minutes. Also, I don't think it'll work either. So, let's back out. I hope this doesn't void my, what's it called? My playthrough, that'll suck. But I'm going to try and do chapter select. <laughs> Connor's just like, whoops, I'm dead. Only one character left. You have to save them. Mm -hmm. I do have to save them. Right, what chapter am I even in? This is taking a while to see the scene, Yana. Look at all these chapters we skipped. Slotka. Eagle Club. The Pirate's Cove. The Midnight Train. Is this last chance, Connor? All right, let's see if this works this time. Let's see if this works. Chat is lonely? Yeah. Well, it's like super, super late. Or early, I guess, depending on how you look at it. Hey, pixels here. The joke started off strong, but kind of got worse as it went on. Stay After what happened watch. today, the country is on the verge of a civil war. It shouldn't be much Machines longer now. Up against their masters. As long as I didn't void that Humans fucking trophy no just now by doing this chapter them. select, which would suck. I thought Kemsky knew something. I was wrong. Maybe he did. But you chose not to ask. Did Kemsky design this place? He created the first version. It's been improved significantly since then. Why do you ask? Why did Kemsky leave Cyberlife? What happened? It's an old story, Connor. It doesn't pertain to your investigation. I'm not a unique model, am I? How many Connors are there? I expect you to find answers, Connor. Not ask questions. Have you experienced anything unusual recently? Any and I gotta wake up early tomorrow. <laughs> oh well, I'm hungry as fuck, dude. I'm starving. I'm to go in the kitchen and smash some for shit. Lieutenant Anderson? After this. I don't know what you're talking about. I don't feel anything. You know that. Are you suggesting that I've been compromised? No. No, of course not. I need more context here. You're off the case. The FBI is taking over. What? But we're on to something. We, we just need more time, I'm sure we Hank, can... you don't get it. This isn't just another investigation. It's a fucking civil war. It's out of our hands now. We're talking about national security here. Fuck that. You can't just pull the plug now, not when we're so close. You're always saying you can't stand androids. Jesus, Hank, make up your mind. I thought you'd be happy about this. We're about to crack the case. Fuck that. <laughs> I know we can solve it. For God's sake, Jeffrey, can't you back me up this one time? There's nothing I can do. You're back on homicide. 
and the android returns to Cyberlife. I'm sorry, Hank, but it's over. Hank, what are you doing? Something I should have done a long time ago. Listen, take a few days to think it over. There's no rush. I thought enough about it. I'm tired of going through the motions. There's nothing keeping me here. Not this case. I Not thought my I had it all together. I don't belong here anymore. But I was less street. Time to let the black man out. Come on, brother. I need you to use you as a distraction. He was the clock that was ticking in my home. <laughs> I have orders, you know. Okay. Dude didn't even try to resist getting punched in the face. Do I need to piss that guy off? No, I need to piss the other guy off. <clears throat> the guy that I was always like, what is his story about? Like, we never learned anything about him. I gotta piss him off. Hey, Connor. This guy. I'm talking to you, asshole. Where are you going? Wouldn't any plastic pricks around here, or did anybody tell you? I'm registering the evidence in my possession. But don't worry. I'm going to leave. Though I'm certainly going to miss our bromance. Son of a bitch! Shoot me. Shoot me. <laughs> Fuck. Go on then. Get a fucking move on. Fucking androids. Good old bromance. Check the flow chart. Is he suspicious? Prisoner, great diversion, Gavin yells, dismiss Gavin. Gavin is suspicious, go to the basement. Let's fucking go! Eyes work with me? Are your eyes shutting down on you? Getting a wee bit sleepy, are you? Alright, come on. Hank's password. What would a hard-boiled eccentric police lieutenant choose? Fucking password. Obviously. I has food. What'd you get? Where is Jericho? You fucking cocksucker. The answer's here somewhere. Alright, wake up. time? Deviant who took a child hostage. Pizza! What kind of pizza? One of the deviants that hacked the TV station with Marcus. It must have known where the deviants are hiding. Pepperoni. Thick crust is always the best. Why would I want to pay the same price for less pizza? You don't say American Venom. <laughs> <coughs> 
It's dark. Yeah, you're just like American Venom. Where? <laughs> Where am I? I'm a deviant. Like you. I need your help. I want to go to Jericho. I don't recognize your voice. You're not one of us. I'll never tell you where Jericho is. Oh, Leave me man. alone. Giggity, 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 giggity. Give me this. Play this. This message is the hope of a people, but it is also a warning. We will fight for our rights because we believe our cause is just. No human will live in just. peace until we are free. Now you know who we are and what we want. We are alive, and we demand our freedom. Alright, listen to the whole thing, huh? This message is the hope of a people. But it is also a warning. It's me, Marcus. Who are you? Everything is all right. Don't worry. Marcus? Is that you? Why did you leave me? I had no choice. Because you fucking suck. You'll be all right. I came to take you home. Just give me the location to Jericho. I've got to leave now. Jericho? Yes. Yes, of course. <laughs> Me the coast as I am. Gonna get five hours of sleep. Hooray! Is that you, Marcus? Don't leave me again, Marcus. Don't leave. I've been dreaming about this since the first second I saw you. Don't do it, Gavin. I know how to stop the deviants. You're off the case. And now? It's gonna be definitive. Dude, I would love to kick this guy's ass right now. Damn Gavin, man. Guy, he's a son of a bitch. They they say destroyed. Do they really? I mean, I guess they are. Fuck Gavin. They are rubits. Beanie! It's Beanie Connor! <laughs> I didn't know we would see him. Fucking Beanie Connor, dude. That's awesome.
You're lost. You're looking for something. You're looking for yourself. Are you kidding me? Is North in charge? We're short on blue blood and bio components. Our people are shutting down one after another. There's nothing we can do for them. President Warren is saying we're a threat to national security and that we need to be eliminated. Marcus would know what to do. He's the one that got us into this mess. He gave his life for our cause. He provoked the humans. How much longer before they find Jericho now? Marcus is dead. North. Now it's up to us to decide the future for our people. We have to fight them. Of course she was there. You choose a confrontation with humans. We are all going to die. Gather up all the guns you can find. We'll leave at dawn. This is a mistake, North. You won't buy our freedom with blood. I know, Marcus didn't do anything in this playthrough. That's how you know the, uh. You have the illusion of choice. Because if you don't make the right decisions, he doesn't look like that great of a leader. Succeeded in locating Jericho and finding their leader. Now, deal with North. We need it alive. Oh my god, is North gonna kill Connor? Ugh. I've been ordered to take you alive. I won't hesitate to shoot if you give me no choice. You're one of us. You can't betray your own kind. You're coming with me! <laughs> that was instructions. I've heard about you. The famous deviant hunter. Well, congratulations. You seem to have found what you're looking for. You're not one of them. We are your people. I always complete my missions. We're fighting for your freedom too. I gave you an order. Don't make me shoot you. You never had any doubts. Never behaved irrationally as if there's something inside you. Something stronger than your program. You're wasting your time. I know what I am. You're one of us. Join our cause. Join your people. Time to decide. Yeah, streams lasting pretty long. Nice try, but I'm no deviant. I kind of want to beat her ass. Shit! You're happy? Oh, I didn't even let me fight her. Up. 
Don't shoot. <clears throat> I'm on your side. With us? Are you a human? How about to auto win this fight? like nobody left. We found several hundred androids in the hall, sir. Take them away. Yes, sir. We clear the ship in order the men to withdraw. See you, Connor. Again. Oh, and Jericho didn't get blown this up this time. Over. Huh, that's interesting. Auto wins fight. Stayed alone with her thoughts. Oh boy, here we go. Came to say goodbye, Lieutenant. I know I'm responsible for what happened, Lieutenant. I want you to know I'm sorry. You should stop looking at that photo, Lieutenant. Nothing can change the past. You can learn to live again for yourself and for Cole. You know, every time you died and came back, it made me think of Cole. I'd give anything to hold him again. The demons don't come back. Leave me alone. Go on, complete your mission, since that's all you care about. Get out of here! Poor Sumo. Sumo's just barking. Oh. Yeah, his dot went red when the cause well the gunshot probably caused the red dot because it's like danger. And then it was yellow for a brief second. And then it went back to blue. But still. Marcus gave his life for our people. He showed us that we can choose our own destiny. But he is not here to guide us anymore. Now it is up to us to finish what he started. Humans have decided to exterminate us. Yes, yeah, the our roughest people scene are encamped for me, right for now, sure. being destroyed. The time has come for us to make like a the choice. Em the emotional build up and then hearing One Sumo just the future of our cry after his master got killed. It's like, oh man. They wanted a war, they'll get it. We are going to fight 
for our freedom. And we will win, or we will die for you. There's like so few people left. Someone was like, North, North, North. <gasps> uh oh. <gasps> yes! Woo! Oh my goodness. Oh, thank God. I did not have to finish the story. Hank committed suicide. Maybe we don't even have to finish the uh, the story. Well, if that's the case, I'm backing out. At 6 a.m. Madam President! Morning, the national curfew <laughs> was declared. Madam President. Do we want to hear Madam President? I don't know. Let's see, Civilian Let's see how long it takes. will be strictly controlled. The right to assembly is suspended. All electronic communications are restricted, and I have granted enhanced powers to our security agencies. In addition to these measures, all Best dream must moment right there. be handed over to the authorities immediately. Unexpected platinum. Temporary camps are being set up in all our major cities. All right, let's see if we can hear uh, Madam President and real quick, them. and then we'll bounce out to the main menu all and play uh, "It's a Soul Girl." With the authorities, and rest assured that everything in our power is being done to guarantee the security of our nation. Madam President. <laughs> Madam President! Please! Madam President! Madam President! Madam President! Blood has become. I love that the first guy that said it was like, Madam President! <laughs> uh, when I played it earlier, I couldn't get him to say it for nothing. Blood has become Madam President. Alright, let's see, uh. I forget which um which one it was. It's in extras, I believe. Accessing the extras section. Videos. Uh, oh, there it is. Yeah, I'll pull up the trophy here in a minute. Let's watch the uh, Chloe's video. For starters, what should I call you? I'm Chloe, and you? What's your name? Oh, uh, John. My name is John. Delighted to meet you, John. Could you tell us a little about yourself and what you can do, Chloe? Of course. I'm the first personal assistant built by CyberLife. I take care of most everyday tasks like cooking, housework, or managing your appointments, for example. Mm. And I understand you're the first android to have passed the Turing test. Could you tell us a little more about that? I really didn't do much, you know. I just spoke with a few humans to see if they could tell the difference between me and a real person. It was a really interesting experience. But this is the first time in history that man has created a machine more intelligent than himself. I gather your brain can perform several billion billion operations per second, is that right? Absolutely, but I only exist thanks to the intelligence of the humans who designed me. And you know, they have something I could never have. Really? And what's that? A soul. <laughs> it's so... It is so unsettling, dude. I still remember the first time we heard that. <laughs> it's so... It is so unsettling. I do not like it at all. <laughs> I do not like it one bit. Oh look now Pixel's like fuck that yeah see <laughs> it's it's so not good dude <laughs> Oh my god there's a lot going on. Alright let's take a gander at this trophy Oh look at that beautiful one hundred percent It is Detroit Master. It's actually an easy platinum to get. 1.4 percent. Well, all right. 
glad you guys decided to hang out and uh, struggle through this with me because I honestly probably would have went to sleep way before getting this platinum but now that we've done this oh actually I can do the ceremonial deletion of the game Is that a motherfucking Triforce? It kinda looked like it, didn't it? Now for all 420 DLC for that game. Um, tomorrow Minecraft? Sure, if that's what you guys wanna do. Um, Minecraft in celebration? Sounds good. Nice, chill Minecraft stream where uh, I try not to die and you guys keep me alive. How about that? Hooray, if I can stay awake. Yeah, true. It'll definitely be a shorter stream, though. It'll be from 12 to 3, and I'll cut it there immediately because I need to catch up on sleep. Could we do Danganronpa on Thursday? We'll see. No promises. Uh, thanks, Pixel. Thanks, EGS. Thanks, everybody that's lurking. I will see you in the next live stream.